In West Philadelphia, born and raised on the playgrounds, where I spend most of my days. Cooling out, maxing, relaxing, all cool. I'll shoot some b ball outside the school. And a couple of guys, they was up to no good. Started making trouble in my neighborhood. I got one little fight, and my mom got scared. She said, You're moving with your auntie and your uncle in North Dakota. Hey! <laughs> what? Good. Monday show. Hey, yeah, happy new we are year. Here. Happy new year. The first day of the girl. What's going on? What's up, y'all? I missed y'all. So, um, yeah, yeah I missed you guys too. It's been a minute. It's been a minute. What's going on? It's been a very eventful. Very interesting day. Yeah. Past uh, 12 hours. Dun, dun. Sure. Huh? A lot of developments. Um, I just can't see no, to shake I'm good. Philadelphia. I mean, yeah. my... Yeah. my my ex was out there. Shout out to Meek Mill. Was, yeah, shouts to Meek. Meek's got a new song. Uh-huh. Yes. Over the Eye of the Tiger sample. Yes. I heard he's doing some new shit with Uzi, too. Fire, yeah. Which is fire. I'm excited about. Like, so we also have a... We got No Jumper a cast member. A No Jumper sure cast, cast member. member um, who um, mm-hmm. rookie, allegedly... Rookie of the Year nominee. Allegedly of the year. went to school in Philadelphia. So, yeah, so... It, it gets a little deeper than that. We gonna let well, let's get deep. We gonna we gonna let Flacco unpack his narrative because right, right, right. because the, you know a lot of people have had a lot of things in their mouth. Um, a Facebook post mm-hmm. popped up from one of his classmates, Joe Fletcher. Shouts to Joe Fletcher. We'll be calling him as well. Yeah, um, we will. But first, we gonna chop game with Flacco because allegedly. Flacco always told us that he was from North Dakota. He was born in Liberia, moved to North Dakota when he was like three years old. Mm -hmm. Um, He says he's 24 years old, right? Yes. Something like that. Ish. Ish. 24, um, 28, 27, 29, He never says specifics. He just like get the... He kind of let us say what we going to say. Right. So <laughs> we, but we gonna let fuck um, is this nigga Batman. Who is poetic? But I, 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 I rock. You know, I rock with Flacco. So we going we not just gonna pack him out. We gonna see what he got to say. Uh-huh. So we uh-huh. gonna call poetic Flacco right uh-huh. now. Doom uh-huh. doom. Can you see the screen? Left? It'd be nice if it was a little bigger. Can y'all zoom in the screen? Yo, Lush. Poetic Flacco. What's good, my brother? <laughs> huh? What's good, my guy? Yo, man, bro. Uh, yo, listen, man. Like, I told myself, bro, I was not going to be in drama in 2023, yo, because, bro, the last month was crazy, bro. You feel me? A drama after drama after drama after drama, bro. You feel me? Like, and it was insane, bro. I told myself this new starting month, I'm not going to be in drama, bro. Right? Well, well again, look, bro, like, as they say. Wait, 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 right? Yeah. Right, bro. Again, bro, like, the last month was tough, bro. I- I'm talking about, like, dealing with some other shit, shit that nobody even, like, knows about, right? So I told myself, man... 2023, I'm going to stay, stay, stay out of drama, mind my business, you feel me? I'm going to just, you know, just be me, you feel me? Just, you know, just be out the way. And then the first day in January, well, no, 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 uh, just like the third day, I think. Second. Drama, you bro, know like, I'm is. like, damn, man, you feel me, man? But, you know, uh, we got, you know, you know. Well, here's um, the thing, Flacco. You know, the, the truth shall set you free. Mm-hmm. There's a, 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 whatever <laughs> whatever was it. stated before and whatever narratives you was kicking. You know, crazy. Huh? No, whatever you was saying before, it doesn't even matter. We just want to know the truth moving forward. This is also, I, I want to go on record and say, this wasn't Suspect's idea. This wasn't Gina's idea. This call came straight from the top. Adam wanted us to unpack this, you know, so. Facts. And Adam's. No, 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 no bro, 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 listen. So, you know, I definitely get it, right? You feel me? Um, and I was actually, like, supposed to be in person with y'all, but, you know, I'm filming a podcast here soon, man. Feel me, man? But, yeah, man, you know, like. Let, me ask you, let me ask you some questions. Cap. Let me ask you some questions. Okay. <laughs> so, you're born in Liberia, correct? Yeah. And how old were you when you moved to the United States? Uh, bro, I forgot. Probably like two or three. Uh, okay, so, around them. So you were a baby. You were like an infant. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Hey, right. Hey, right. Lunch, but also two is like, bro. Like, so um, having a uh, hey, right. So having an employer as an immigrant, right? Like, you have to give out like certain like documents, right? So 
um, Josh and Adam and them, you feel me, you know, and like have have like my ID, green card, social security number, right? So like all of this is like you verifiable information. Do, do you know what approximately what year you moved to the U.S.? Like two, like like oh one oh two. Like I'm not even sure, you know, right? But bro, like thing is this though, right? Is so I think the main question that everybody wants to know for me, right? And like I'm going to address it real quick, right? Is yo, you not from like yo, like you not from North Dakota, like you capping, bro. Um, wait, hold on. R- right before you get into that, yeah, wait, wait, we, wait, we, wait, we, wait. We, we're not letting you steer this one. We know we, we, this we, one. we know you as Frederick Jala. Is your do you have an alias of Minyango Tokpa? Bro, uh, hey, right? So, look, so again, like my full name is Frederick Minyango Jala. You feel me now? Um, after college, I changed my uh, Facebook name, right, to Minyango Tokpa, because my mom's last name is Tokpa, right? So when I changed it, it's to just not be found by, you know. Okay. What is... Hmm. So how old are you, and what's your date of birth, month, day, and year? Bro, wait, 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 pause, bro. <laughs> you asking mad federal questions? Hey, right that's now. what. He me and, oh, what's cool? Well, that's that's what they look, told look, you to ask. Look, I was born. I was born. I was born, I was born December eighteenth, nineteen eighty one. My name is Nicholas Carletti. Here I comes from Los Angeles, California. I was born in Cedar Sinai Hospital at approximately eleven forty four p.m. I'll say mine. I was born October twenty fifth, nineteen ninety seven. I ain't saying shit. What's up with him? I'm not gonna like give out like, like, like again like okay like, we here did you graduate high school and all that shit right but I do want to address you know but the one thing that I called for right it was niggas saying then what's his real age about being from like North Dakota right that's right, his real age right, yes. right because you know I feel since you can't I say your birthday like, well how like, old like, are you shit, right you feel me one that's not true for me and bro like I've never kept about being from North Dakota right again meaning this bro. I have fucking yearbook picture of, of me in fucking kindergarten to fucking first grade at West Fargo. You feel me, right? I'm from North Dakota. Two, bro, two. Bro, when, 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 when I got here, to be on payroll, I have to, again, my, my, my uh, driver's license, social, green card, car tags is North Dakota, right? So... That's the main thing I do, you feel me, right? Like, I do, you know, like, want to just clarify and, like, hold on, right? It's the capping out, it's about capping about being from, like, North Dakota. So so you moved, so, so from Liberia, you moved to North Dakota, but then at a certain point, you moved to Darby, Pennsylvania, correct? Very briefly, yeah. So you, did you go? Um, did you go to middle school and high school, from seventh grade till you graduated at? Um, no, 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 hell no, right? Nah, 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 right? Nah, right, right here, right. So I, I think either Joe or Rich, right? And, and you could call it right. And like that's the post like that went like mad viral, I think early this morning, right? And I talked to Joe like that early on, right? So I mean, right? So, and Joe's and whole thing is, bro, like, I used to hang out with you when you was down here, right? And you are from here. You feel me? Like, you're right? So why cap about it? And I told him, nah, bro, like, the majority of my life, I'm talking about, like, the majority, I spent it in... North Dakota. Did you ever go to school? Did you ever go to school in Pennsylvania? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. It was what's it called? Penn um Penwood. Yeah, Penwood, yeah. Penwood. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, yeah, yeah. So what years what years did you go to Penwood? Like ninth grade, tenth grade? No, right. So uh, um this from it was from uh um, eighth grade to tenth grade. Eighth grade to tenth grade. So, um, and, and 
So we're we're hearing conflicting data. Did you graduate high school 2011 or 2015? Bro, bro, wait, wait, see, right, bro, listen, exactly, wait, 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 exactly my point, right, 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 so people type in Minyango Topa, right, and, 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 uh, it, 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 you know, my like, life pops up. Why are you not answering um, the question? Because that's what the fuck you do, talk in circles. One, that's cap, right, that's cap. I graduated in 2015. Okay. I did not graduate from Cromwell. You feel me? Right, right. But, right, but when you type in, um, I'm calling, uh, but the M Topa, it comes up on, like, on, like, some, like, weird, obscure site that, uh, and that person graduated in 2011. That would be cap because if, again, bro, if I graduated high school in 2011, I'll be like, well, 30, right? Right. Now, right? no, that makes sense. Wait, 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 right? If I graduated high school in 2011, I will be 30 something. That is absurd, and that's cap. No, I, thank you for clearing that up. I <laughs> has my green card, has everything, right? I gave it to him when I was deployed. I'm not a 30, that, bro, that is absurd, and that's cap, right? And, and then, too, bro. <laughs> It's the BS of like saying, yo, like, you are capping about being from here because, like, we used to, used to hang out with you, right? right? Now I know why you like the Nike boots. It makes perfect sense now because that's for sure, like, some East Coast shit. You know what I'm saying? When when we were talking... Been exposed. No, no, never but lush, never but lush. Like, this thing about this well, shit, Where did right, his bro? accent come from? It's not, bro, like, bro, it's, it's, it's pure nonsense. Because, like, again, bro, like, if a nigga graduated in 2011, Lush, yo, bro, uh, um, I will be what? 30, what, 3, 32? No, I believe you. I believe that you graduated in 2015. That, that, um, thank you for clearing that up. Look, we're, we're not here to attack you. We're just trying to get to the bottom of this because it's confusing. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. We were hearing that though, right? And here's why, like, it's kind of like first thing for me, right? Because one, bro, I've already dealt with a month of this shit, right? Cool. Having to start the new year off again, again, my first thought, right? I, I just like assume, yo, 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 bro, like this is some like fun shit, something, right? It, it, it's some laughing, jokey, joke shit. I was cool with it. And <laughs> then like, once it went from some laughing, laughing, jokey, joke shit to now niggas is. Like, feel me? Like, making this shit a huge, a big deal. I'm like, bro, like, niggas know I'm not 30 plus years old, bro. Like, 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 we don't, look we don't know like, shit at this like, point. Well, look, I I believe you when you say that you're not 30. It's just like, it's hard to know what to believe because we never knew this whole time you was from out there. And now, like, no, we got people. I'm not from out there, Lush. Again, Lush, bro. I spend the overwhelming majority of my life in North Dakota, right? And now two wait with right? And and now two lust. Listen, if folks go to two interviews I did, one with Phil Wessa, right? And uh and during that interview, I said, yo, I was just out there in 2024, a freaking funeral. Right? So bro, like, I've never hit, I got family out there, right? I frequented there before, right? So again, right, like you got an East Coast accent, huh? You got you got an East Coast accent, so it makes sense, right? Right. You, your right. accent never right. made sense because right. if you was from if you was just from Fargo, North Dakota, you wouldn't have that accent like that. You would sound like a nah, like no. a rural white bro. person. That part. Bro. Not that hell no, bro. Like bro, like bro, bro, like we're like a bro, like we're like a melting pot, right? So like again, like um. My, like, quote-unquote, like, accent, bro, I feel, like, come from being Liberian and from out there, right? But again, though, bro, like, I've never hit this shit, right? I've always, again, like, two interviews. So one with Phil Wester and then one with Bobby Zinnino, right? I told Phil Wester, yo, we are related. We have cousins who are from Philly, Right? I was just out there in like 2024, like JP's funeral, right? 
I've always been open about my connection to Philly, right? But the bullshit is this, right? Is folks will take certain seeds and say, yo, let's use these seeds now to, you know, like to like, just like lie on flock around. I'm saying, bro, like, I, I'm a 35 year old man who graduated <laughs> in, in like 2011 and uh, I'm hiding from my. <laughs> Real name, right? It's Niagara Tupper, bro. Like, 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 come on, bro. Like, what type of, like, like, fuck, like, fucking spy kid segregation this is, bro? <laughs> Look, bro, like, Look, bro, like, I, I'm not 30 plus. Like, you feel me, right? For my, He's clinging for my to that. real yeah. legal name is not Niagara Tupper, bro. Feel me, right? Like, that's confirmed already, bro. Okay. That makes sense. The one, um, Look, like, there's other things we're not even going to get into because, like, when it comes to, like, open cases and shit like that, I'm not trying to really I'm unpack like, all bro, that. Bro, wait, what the, listen, right? Bro, look, right? <laughs> bro, look, right? Bro, look, right? Bro, look, like, and it, it's the same shit, right? Is Man, look, when did he move to North Dakota? Fuck all that, because he talking in circles, and, <laughs> and look, <laughs> look, the higher-ups texting me talking about he talking in some circles too much. Get to the point. Get on him. Yeah. You talking in circles too much, nigga. So Stop my fucking plan. Yeah, what, so, get to it, so you lying when, ass nigga. When did you move to North Dakota? <laughs> like, 0102, bro. You feel me? Like, bro, listen, right, bro. And look, when did bro, you move look, to Philly? Like, hey, three way to other nigga. Yeah, yeah, we, we about three to. Other nigga. Look, hold on, Flacco. Hold on. We gonna, we gonna. Yeah. Stay on the line. Just, 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 just post up, Stay all on. right? We gonna, we gonna bring someone on. Stay on the line. Adam is asking us to. Yeah. Stay on the <laughs> line. Nigga's playing too much. Hold up. Fuck. Talking in circles and shit. This is so fucking messy. Come on, Joe Fletcher. Where the fuck you at, bro? <laughs> jo All right, my guy here. We about to merge you with Flacco. <laughs> we about to merge you with Flacco. Yo, 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 Jay, turn it down. Jay, yo, hello? Yeah, we, we about to merge you with Flacco. All right. All right. <laughs> okay, so on the phone right now. <laughs> on the phone right now, Flacco. We have your former classmate, Joe Fletcher. Bro, yeah, bro, Joe, listen. Yeah, bro, Joe, listen, right? But, bro, I just hope this Joe, like, uh, um, like, um. <laughs> like, hey, like, man, hey, uh, man. Yeah, Hold bro, on. Like, no, thank you, Yeah, bro, you feel me? Bro, Joe, my nigga still to this day. Bro, you feel me, bro? Right? Um, right? Uh, right? Um, we talked it. about some shit. You feel me, bro? Right? You feel me? Um, they be like, um, uh, what? Um, apologizing said, bro, like, I should have called you first. You feel me? Right? You feel me? You know, um, but that, but that shit wasn't even for you. Feel me, Facebook? J Joe, Joe, Flacco saying that he was only went to that high school for two years between eighth and tenth grade. Earlier on the phone, you said that he was your classmate from seventh grade to till you graduated in 2015. What's the truth, Joe? Nah, that's cap, bro. So, nah, Let Joe I talk. Mean, uh, but I, nah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let Joe talk. Tell him shut up. Let me talk real quick. Let me talk. Put Flacco on mute or something. I'm talking. Nah, okay. Let me talk real quick. No, no, no. Flacco, you ain't Frederick. I don't know. I don't know you as Flacco. I know you as Frederick and shit. Feel me? And you yeah, 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 yeah. Since seventh grade to twelfth grade and shit, bro. You you been at you lived in Derby in the seventh county. Grade, bro, or eighth grade? bro, you're from the county, bro. You're not from North Dakota. You moved to North Dakota back in 2017, 2018 or some shit. You probably I don't know what the fuck bro, you're doing. Bro, wait, 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 wait. Bro, I got hit, bro. bro. I got wait, 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 bro. wait, 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 how nah, the, let him I keep talking. He's not done I'm yet. Wait, wait, Paul, wait, wait, please, bro, wait. I got, yo, niggas on wait. my Facebook. It's yeah. fucking, yo, I got, it's like the, the, tens of 20 people on my Facebook in the comments claim that you be, you be all with the school together. Everybody talking exactly. about it. Bro. Yeah, bro, Joe, I'm trying Everybody to see, bro. Wait, 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 Paul, wait, please, wait, bro, wait. Again, wait, though. <laughs> you said that, uh, like, 2017, bro. <laughs> I was like in 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 like what like uh second year of my college. Bro, listen, bro, listen, 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 man, listen. Right? Nah, nah, wait, wait, wait. wait. Flacco, was it seventh grade to twelfth or eighth to tenth? That's all I want to say, man. 
Anybody around this question? Just right, Joe, right? Wait, 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 wait. With though, right? Uh, I do want to say something about the Joe, right, bro? Uh, uh, think it's right, bro? It is like, bro, one Joe, like, I fuck with you, dog, too, bro. Like, we talk, right? Uh, um, but we talked, like, probably, like, three hours ago, right, bro? And yeah, you talk. I'll let you know. Listen, 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 I'll let you wait, know. Wait, 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 wait. I told you I apologize and shit for 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 for, for making yeah, it. Yeah, but why even like why even like come up here, right? What? Like just do this fuck shit, bro. You feel me? Right, right, like. Uh, it's like why it's come like, expose like, the truth? I, now you mad because he came and told the truth? Bro, because again, bro, it, it, in 2017, bro, like, bro, how, bro? Again, bro. Flacco, why are you embarrassed to be from Delco? It's a cool place you've grown up. It makes you say, seem way more valid. He said, Boo Flacco, we want to hear from Joe. Adam. Adam said, Boo Flacco, we want to hear from Joe. I'm going to let him say it. So again, bro, how is that possible that I left in 2017? But again, bro, Joe, I fuck with you, bro. Bro, bro, this is here, bro, right? I'm waiting for, bro, I'm waiting for somebody to send me the pictures from the yearbook, bro. You in the fucking yearbook, my nigga. He said he in the yearbook. I'm waiting for somebody to send me the pictures in, but I got pictures with me. You was in high school. Remember we did the talent show? You was the whole talent show and shit. You was in the yearbook. Yo, listen, right, right. But yo, listen, but yo, bro. I got I got multiple people hitting me up saying the same story. Yeah, bro, it's Tim, bro. Right, 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 bro, you on some camping shit, bro. You on some camping shit, bro. Stop lying, bro. Niggas caught you on the line, bro. You do not do this shit, though, right? Like, bro. bro. You made a video talking about you from North Dakota. You was born and raised in North Dakota and shit. You only been in Dakota for a couple months. No, you wasn't. You was, born, bro, you was here, bro. I was with you in seven days, nigga. I was with you in seven days all the way to Tom Brady, bro. I'm not watching bro. Wait, 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 bro, wait, wait, bro, 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 wait, bro, 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 I can't even fucking do it. I got the hiccups. I need something to drink. I need some water. Fuck. Hey, what did he do in the talent show? What did he do in the talent show? What was his talent? He was the host. Right? Bro, that was fucking 10th grade, right? He been hosting. That was 2015. That was 2015, bro. Stop lying, bro. And that nigga, Adam said, he said him and let Joe talk. Adam said, shut Flacco up and let Joe talk. Flacco, we'll call you back. All right. We're going to fly. We're going to call you back. We're going to call Flacco back. Flacco, Adam's telling us to cut you and have just Joe. Flacco. Why would you lie about your life and you mad at him? Fuck wrong with you? Weird ass nigga. Weird ass nigga lie about his whole life, mad at another nigga who telling the truth. Look at him. Wait. Nigga, you know me too well, bro, and I know you too well from the can of thing, bro. Like since you was a Hey, who's the white boy in the picture? <laughs> Who, who's the white boy in the talent show? He looks like Jeffrey Dahmer. The fool looked like a serial killer. Looks like a young Jeff Daniels. Yeah. Look, let's hear Joe talk. Here, here, here. You're being too nice, here, 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 Flacco, Shut Flacco. Shut Flacco the fuck up. You're being too nice. Flacco. Let Joe talk. Flacco. We'll Flacco, call you back. we gonna call you we'll back call because you back. Adam wants us to talk to Joe for a minute. This is coming from Adam. We gonna call you back. Just stand by. All right. All right. Okay, Joe. So, Joe, what, what's going on, bro? So, earlier you said you've known him from seventh grade to twelfth grade, correct? Yes. And um, you said that he moved to. Uh, Darby, Pennsylvania, which has a big Liberian community, correct? So it would make sense not, that he would live a, there. Not a, it's not a white community. It's a, it's a, it's a full-blown black African community and shit like that. Right. You see Africans, you see a lot of Liberians, and you know what I'm saying? All kinds of Africans from, from different countries and shit that live in Darby, that live in Yaten and shit. They from Southwest Philly and shit. 
Darby is right near the Southwest Philly and shit. That's why I be saying he from Philly, but he really from the county though. He from Darby and shit. So what? You know what I'm saying? He wasn't never active in the streets and none of this shit. He was, he was always a schoolboy and shit. He was always in the crib and shit. You know what I'm saying? Were but you guys yeah. friends? We were never best friends either. We never even hung out outside of school. I had my friends, I had my niggas I grew up with, I was in the streets with and shit. I never hung, I never seen Frederick outside. And plus, me and him, we never hung out. We'd be out probably hung out with him in school and shit. I was probably probably cheating off on him on the test or some shit like that, but I wasn't even like, you know what I'm saying? We wasn't, he wasn't, he was cool. Like I said, I ain't had no problems with Frederick and shit. Why do you? I, I, fought one, I fought one of his men in eighth grade. I beat up one of his men in eighth grade. His, his, one of his homies and shit. Why do you think he's lying about his name and where he's from and all of that? Like, why do you think that's he's lying about that? I, why, why I think he's lying? Yeah, why do you think he's lying? I think I don't know. I think he probably fucking. I, I think he just didn't want something coming back, biting him in his ass or some shit. I think he probably got some skeletons in his closet or something. My thing is, like, I ain't give a fuck about what happened in the squares. Like I said, I just seen a video of him on Cap, Cap, Cap uh, Capone News or some shit, and him talking about he from, from North Dakota. He was never from North Dakota. He was always from, um, he was always, he, he, was, he was from Darby. Are you saying he yeah. never lived in North Dakota? He, he said he moved there afterwards. He said he moved to North Dakota after. But he that, didn't. His upbringing wasn't in North Dakota. That's what he's saying. Yeah. He didn't move to North Dakota. He moved there like 2017, 2018, or some shit like that. Okay. Because before he said when he was 2001. Yeah. He, people is people all on my Facebook and shit. They all his yeah. The people that I graduated with, they all say they, they they all know this dude. You know what I'm saying? Um, and everybody saying the same shit. Then why does nigga lying and shit? Why why he on YouTube lying and shit? Like, does it kind of piss y'all off because you're like, damn, this is someone that is from our area and we were proud of him for doing good. Like, why isn't he claiming us? Is that kind of how y'all felt? Yeah, like niggas was hype, like, oh yeah, he on no jumper now. I remember him post posters about him being on no jumper and shit. I remember that nigga deleting all his old posts because you know he on Facebook. He used to post, like, controversial posts and shit. He used to be, be some out-of-pocket posts and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? But, you know what I'm saying? But they, they, then he got on. I was happy for him. I was genuinely happy for Bull, bro. Like I said, when I came across that one video, I'm like, yo, what the fuck? Like, what type of shit is this? Like, this nigga is claiming he from North Dakota and shit? Like, that's your corny. J Joe, how was... How you gonna deny where you from and shit? Like, how you gonna reject where you from, not, not, you know, not speak on and claim a whole fucking state far uh -huh. away and shit like that? I, you know what I'm saying? Like, that, that, that's corny as shit. I'm not asking you to incriminate yourself. Now, Flacco's uh, said he's got pictures, and he's sending pictures trying to refute these claims. Um, so we're going to bring Flacco back, uh, but I, I have a couple more questions. Um, first of all, Joe, not, not to incriminate yourself, but were you in the streets growing up? I know you said Flacco wasn't, like, about that. Were you that type of guy? Yeah, I, yes, I, I was that type of guy. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna say nothing. I ain't gonna say nothing too crazy, but I was outside and I did do shit. Project okay. on the other hand, he ain't do shit. Like, I ain't seen him. Like, I, I was I was in school too. Like, don't get me wrong. Like, I, I graduated from high school and shit. I graduated with, with a nice GPA too. I changed my life around at some point. You know what I'm saying? But like, I, like, like, like I said, like, I was. I was I was outside and shit, but Frederick he wasn't he wasn't a street dude. He was a nerd. He was he was always in school and shit. Now to you be fair, saying? he's never claimed he was a street dude, so that's consistent. Right. Flacco never said he was a street dude. Um, any other questions? I think that I think we I think we saw it. Um, but for the but for the record, you're saying that Flacco grew up with you guys and then he went to South Dakota. Not he was in South Dakota and then moved with you guys. And, and you. And you for show he was there from seventh to twelfth grade. Yeah, he was there from seventh. Like I said, I'm waiting for the graduation picks. Like the pictures I sent you, that was from the talent show 2015. I wasn't from no seventh grade. Okay. That was from 2015 and shit. You know what I'm saying? He was the host. He was the he was the host type. He was the host bull for the show and shit. You know what I'm saying? And the host bull. <laughs> you for show from Philly. Hey, it was the John with the John. He's the host bull. Um and um. So basically was from, you don't know him to have lived in North Dakota prior to seventh grade though, do you? No, no, yeah. probably, like I said, people probably know him, cause I, I'm from Philly and shit, so we, and like I said, like, he lived in the county, so 
niggas, niggas who lived in the county probably know him probably over seven grade. He probably went to one of the elementary schools around that area at that time. Was uh, w- w- was Fred was Frederick Jala a nut ass freak bull? Listen, bro, he's a fucking fraud, bro. Yeah. So hold on, hold on. This is my man. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This is my man Eric. He, my man Eric knows old pressure too. And I got my man Jason on the, the phone too. Ask him, do he know? Ask him, do he know? Bankroll game Bankroll Gangster Jason. Ask him, do he know? Ask him, do he know? Bankroll Gangster Jason. Ask him, do he know? Ask him, do he know? Bankroll game Bankroll Gambino. When he was just on the interview with the Bull Seafood, right? He just spit that shit, bro. First of all, bro, he hit the jaw. He said, when you fly from the county, you go through Cobb Creek and hit King Session, bro. You only got to be from Philly to know that. Shit, hmm. bro. That's some Philly shit. Hmm. Yeah, that sounds pretty Philly-ish to me. What what fraud activity has he done? Why are you so, calling him a fraud? So, so, so on the website, bro, it said 2008, bro. He knew he graduated in 2015. I'm waiting for my man that played basketball on the on the team to send me the yearbook page. Mm. So he's saying he didn't graduate out there. He's saying he graduated in North Dakota. Yeah, yeah. So, so, so. He he, heavy on the Kango kid. You feel me? Heavy on the Kango. Okay. Okay, what, what, so what, is there other fraud activities that you're implying that he did? No, it's just he, he was camping, you feel me? And I know somebody that knows, that knows him in between Joe, and remember he said that he know his cousin was a rapper out there in the situation this day and the third. I know his cousin, you feel me? But his cousin not here to speak, to speak on case no more. He passed away a few years. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. My condolences, RIP to him. Um, Eric, do you his name Eric or Aaron? Did you know him in elementary or you met him in seventh grade? Did, 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 did all y'all meet him in seventh grade or did y'all know him in elementary? No, I ain't meet him in seventh grade. I, I, I seen him a few times through, through up and through the county or whatever. Okay, middle school. I'm from Southwest. Okay. See, so you said they met him in middle school. But me and my man Jason, me and my man Jason, he on the phone right now too. Like I said, we, we grew up with this nigga. We watched this nigga grow up and shit. Like, for, like, for when he was skinny, you got his shit right now. This nigga, you know what I'm He was a skinny-ass boy, and he always had a stutter, too. He always had a stutter. He had a stutter problem his whole life and shit. Is there anything that you guys know about him? Can you give us an insider background? Every question, bro, he can't, bro. Everything, every question y'all ask, he tries to get around that shit. You got to think about it when y'all talk about his story. He goes around you. When y'all ask him about any North Dakota story, he goes around you. He never gave y'all game. Go around so everything. Tell that nigga to call with somebody from North Dakota. He sat down with, 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 uh, with, with um, Jalil B. to Ubaka, and he sat down with um C.C. He talked all that Philly shit. And his accent says... No, the accent for show is Philly. He know where he's from. He's from the county, bro. Didn't you say there was something that happened with, like, his girl and that's why he dipped? What What, what was that all about? No, I ain't say nothing happened with his girl. I said y'all gotta watch when he paints that narrative about my girl this, my girl that, but y'all never seen shit. Not because Joe, cause Joe said something about, like, his girl and that's why he right. dipped, but... What happened? What happened, Joe? What happened, Joe? What happened? Joe, what happened with this girl that made him dip and moved to North Dakota? Oh, shit. All right. Yeah, I don't know. I got some Joe names. Uh, I, don't, I don't know. I tell them or whatever her name is, but he was talking to some some some, some cute light-skinned uh, African Joe, whatever. I don't remember she was exposing him and shit. I, I think this was around the time. I don't know if he was still around or he was in North Dakota and shit. I don't know. But she was using Bull for his money and shit. I remember him posting about that shit. Uh, how she used him for his money and all that shit. Blah blah blah. She was he was she was playing he was she was playing him and shit like that. I don't know that that, that played into effect. Him dealing with these bitches out here and shit. They got him. They got him this this on in his where he's from and shit. Like, <laughs> Did he you know fuck? Who he fucked with and shit like that. I don't know. Yeah, but, Gina wants to know if he fucked. I don't know. What was he posting? Drake yeah, lyrics? That's what made, that's, that's what made him move. Was he posting the lyrics to Marvin's room? Huh? Yeah. He posted. <laughs> that's a, yeah. I never probably going through a thing, but we had that shit on repeat or something. I don't know. Fuck. You be hearing when you said the Nike boots, bro. That's a that's a Philly thing. I already know. That's what. That's why I like. Lunch, I, lunch, you said 
said your, your girl from the from from the city, bro. Yeah, she from Norristown. Yep. I be I be Norristown. Listen, Norristown. That's where they all at. You feel me? Right off top. A bunch top. of crack teeth. A bunch of crack teeth up there, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> You know the vibes. You know the vibes. Shouts to all my, uh, shouts to all my Southwest and West Philly peoples. Uh, my boy. Yep. Shouts to my boy K Walker, my boy Easy the Black Captain, all my Philly peeps. You feel me, Cass? Yeah, I, pre I appreciate you. Uh, appreciate both of y'all. We we if we if necessary, we'll call y'all back. But regardless, anything y'all want to plug before we dip? Yeah, yeah. I want to give a shout out to uh to, to take over take over podcast take over files. I want to give a shout out to my man, my brother YR. I want to give a shout out to my brother, see my nigga Skeen. Y'all can follow me on Instagram, JP Fletch. You know what I'm saying? Follow my man, Philly Made J and shit. You know what I mean? On the gram and shit. That's all I want to say. Yeah. Hey, 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 what's your before y'all dip? What's y'all favorite uh cheesecake cheesesteak shop in Philly? Delisandro's yeah. over there in Roxboro is fire. Nah, fuck that. I fuck with Ishka Bibbles. But yeah, that shit is delicious. But uh, but yeah, Delisandro's in in, in Roxboro go crazy. Appreciate y'all. The best African spot, the best West African restaurant is in Upper Darby too. Uh, Kings and Queens and shit. Go tap in and come too, man. I'm gonna ask Frederick about the Darby issues. Appreciate y'all. He wasn't. Listen, I'm telling the truth. He wasn't lying about General Butt Naked. This shit is real. So he did know General Butt Naked. Mm. No, he don't know General Butt Naked. It's impossible. Listen, at the, at the time oh. that General Butt Naked was going through his war crimes, Flacco wasn't even in fucking Africa. So he's lying. You feel yeah, me? He's lying about that, too. That nigga's a fucking lie. He's lying wrong. like shit at the end of the day. You feel me? But General Butt Naked, this shit is true. You feel me? Cut used to, he used to cut people, cut kids back. No, we know General Butt Naked is real. We know that's real, but uh, Adam even Adam was like, I don't think it's true that he really knew him, but I, I, I guess he, don't know, he, don't know him, he said that was his pastor. <laughs> he don't know him at all. Listen, I live in Southwest. I live in the African hood. This nigga Spock was a liar, bro. Come on. Well, we appreciate y'all time. Y'all y'all have a great evening out there. Right, bang, bang, bird bang. gang. Y'all be smooth. What wow. the ever loving fuck ain't this about a I bitch. need I need us to get them uh the soundboard so we can play do 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 that's the, that's, that's like crazy. That, if AD was here is the verdict in ain't that I mean we going to call him back we going to call Flacco back cuz I'm not going to yeah, it's about that time I'm not going to do <gasps> Flacco like that I this... don't know what's going on here shout out to uh Fresh Prince of Bel Air shout do, out to do, Easy do. to Block yeah. Captain <laughs> shout, <laughs> shout out to Big Bill my, my, Will Smith. my boy Dub the Phenom yeah. my boy Slaughter Rico you Kaboom Frank with the Grippers all my Philly peeps oh you dig you dig shouts to Philly Swain Ain't shouts to Rosenberg Rob shout Bill out to Collector Philly Swain. Yeah. yeah it's crazy um all right should so we call up? Uh, back? Is that yeah. what we're doing? So right. before we call him back, is there anything? What we got to do is have him get someone from North Dakota on the phone. Right. But the question is, he could get anyone on the phone and say they're from North Dakota. Oh, look, the Penwood Talent Show. Okay. The, yeah, we have the pictures from the Penwood Talent Show. Is it the video? Show. But him hosting the talent show is definitely in line with his line of work. That means yeah. no different from me. I always was hosting shit, right. you know? So that right. makes sense. You All host shit, you yeah. host shit. So him hosting the talent show, it makes so much sense. Facts. I don't understand. So, okay, what, what is this Moorhead, Minnesota? What? He sent a snap from 2016 in Moorhead, Minnesota. I, I don't. That doesn't know. make any sense. But that'd just, be after you. I want to know if he a fed informant. I just want to know like what happened to you in Philly that's making you lie about not being from there. Like I just don't understand. It was like, the light skin African. What's John. so important? Yeah. Uh, the gerb. It was the gerb. I just don't get it. <laughs> the like, gerb. What the <laughs> fuck? Yeah, like, what's, <laughs> I don't get it, bro. The girl, yo. <laughs> so my nigga big, so every bitch that he fuck with, they playing for his cash? That's crazy. Which isn't cool. Which it, isn't cool. And, and he didn't fuck. 
Ain't he ain't getting no cooter. I wasn't even going to put him on blast about that. We did ask about something else, about the smelling thing, too. Oh, well, yeah. What y'all asked? Gina, why don't you say this part? <laughs> I think I've said enough. <laughs> so uh, earlier on the phone conversation, Lush asked if Flacco smelled back in the day. And Joe didn't say yeah, but he didn't say no. Mm. Yeah. Mm. So he's uh, that's, how, that, that's a nice way so of putting like a, <laughs> is that is that how you recollect everything? I mean, somewhat. He, <laughs> he gave an evasive answer and said there might have been some days. So yeah. so he's a habitual stinker. Even when he was skinny. Damn, just a habitual stinker. Now, now I believe those pictures that he showed us when he was skinnier. I just him being don't skinny ask ten crazy. years ago versus him being skinny. Three years ago makes more sense to me. I just don't understand why he isn't proud to be what from like a cool is, what area. Is, what is this? What is this? Why would you want to be from? Is this court America? paperwork? Uh, we not go. We not gonna do all that. If it's open case, we not gonna do all that. It's school paperwork. School cool. paperwork. Okay. Okay, Delco. Oh shit. Twenty fifteen. Damn. Frederick Jala. Damn. Fuck. Damn. Flacco. Twenty fifteen. Middle school. That's middle school. But he did say seventh grade though. It's high school. High school. Oh shit! The Penwood High School Delco High Q team was recognized for participation in the 2015 Delaware County High Q competition. Penwood senior, blah 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 blah. Then it's the list of the of the team. Um, Heyban Ali, Heverlange, Ag Agusti, Magnet, Fafana, Frederick Jala, JB Jala. And what is this? The team of what? High Q, I imagine it's like the math team or some shit. Oh, okay. The mathletes. So where is this 2011 thing coming from? Was he held back? No. I don't okay. think the, yeah, I don't believe the 2011 thing. I think, I mean, all the stories are consistent. He said, didn't I just he don't get why school? he wouldn't admit it. Didn't he say he went to high school in, in North Dakota? Yes. yes. And that exactly. And this, this proves proof right here that he did it. Come All right. Because where's his North come Dakota on. yearbook? Yeah, come on. Oh, shit. We got a prom pick. <laughs> <laughs> 2015 prom. Where? What school? I don't, oh, here. Is that him? I guess that's him. Let me see. Let, let's see. Yeah. Oh, this is the champagne party. Let me see. And what grade do, does oh, that's him like right that? there. senior year? Oh, he do like black women. So this happens in senior year? Who sent that? Th that's from Joe Fletcher. He went to fucking prom in Philly? I know in North Dakota they're not having champagne parties. That's there's a hood not, champagne party. There's not six black people that's in North Dakota. That's a hood champagne party. Let's you've be real. That's in Philly. You've been exposed. There's not six black people. They're not North doing Dakota. champagne parties in North Dakota. That's in Philly. You've been exposed. Call him. All right. Oh, he's been exposed. The champagne party... Cause he said that he, hey, <sighs> hey, dun, 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 dun. hey, you said what? You said what? Do, do. He don't understand how much credit. Here, get on the mic. Get on the mic, Vast Time. What'd you say? Turn Vast Time mic on. <laughs> Please, Riley. Thank you. Fourth mic, Vast Time. What's good? All I said was, if you wanted to be a rap journalist and you said you were from Philly, you would, you would get more respect. A lot more. Yeah. yeah. Than if you said you're from North Dakota. Absolutely. Facts. Absolutely. Why That's why I don't do get that. why he's running with this. This is like the weirdest narrative ever. He's Because that's to what make makes him more sus is that he's saying he's from North Dakota. Because that's what would be like, you a fucking weirdo, nigga. You from North Dakota. But if he was from yeah. Philly, be, oh, okay, this nigga from Philly. Mm -hmm. but, Philly. But it kind of like he knows he's an eccentric cat. So he's like him saying, I'm from North Dakota. It is. Makes it, it makes seem it like, seem like oh, okay, it makes sense. Why you're you're like isolated, that, you're but awkward because you're from North Dakota, so you're not. But how about this grade A ma manipulation that he done came in here with telling us that he from fucking North Dakota when you really from the fucking gutter? Right. Well, it, it's not super hood where he's from, but it's not. Yeah. It's not North Dakota. That's you're near crazy West Philly. Because, nigga, that picture right there, you said that you left. What age did he say? That he, um, he said he was there from 8th to 10th grade. Come in, on. 10th grade is not no fucking champagne party. They have a champagne party in 10th grade? That's all I no. want to know. You no. have been exposed. Hold on. I'm going to go to the bathroom, call his app. <laughs> all right. This is crazy. I, I really, I hope that he just admits it. We won't even be mad. 
I think Adam might low key really trip out on him if he doesn't admit it. A little bit. I don't know if he's even gonna pick up. Yo, Lush, yo, bro, listen, right? So look, here, look, put this up real quick, man. Okay. Look, no, no, look, bro. And here's my damn social security card, bro. Okay. Bro, look, and here's my ID, bro. Okay, let's take a look. The social security card. Yeah, but it does like this doesn't say anything. We just we see your name. Yeah. All right. Look, and that's Fargo, right? Oh, okay. The address. Yeah. Yes. It, the address that your social security guard was sent to, I will verify, is in Fargo, North Dakota. But you could, I, I got my social security card again because I had lost mine last year. Or, or, or look, the better it is. Look, look, the better it is. Look at this. Look, again. What state did you go to prime in? Look, look, look. I'm going to tell you. Like what state too. did you go to prime in? Look, I'm going to tell you this too right now. And real quick, and one second. What state I'm did you go to prime in? I'm going to see this. He sent his social. So he didn't say what state he was from? No. So, so when you asked, what did he say? Though? He's not. He's ignoring me. So you no, asked no, 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 no. Wait, like, sit down on the mic. So like, it's 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 you know, like hard to hear. What's happening, man? What's going on? Okay, Bro, so Flacco, please. What year? So, did you go to prom in North Dakota or Philly? I took my bitch to prom, bro. Where? 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 I spent the majority of my life in Fargo, North Dakota. I'm from Fargo, North Dakota, right? I stayed Bro, in Philly, right? Years, I've never denied that, ten. right? I think it's people saying that I'm lying years. about being from North Dakota. That's not true. Bro, listen, bro. Like, I have fucking yearbook pictures from, from the fucking, like, first grade, bro, of me being in them bitches. Feel me, right? So, like... I, like, I don't understand, one, right, like, why is this shit a big deal, two? Man, just bro, ask like, him where did he go to prom? About being from, did he go from, to prom like, in North Dakota? Like, Dakota? Dakota right? You got right, more but, pictures, bro, Again, right, my ID is on Fargo. Send it to the group chat. My, my, my social security number is on Fargo. My fucking green card is from Fargo, right? Okay. And, 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 um, what year did you go to prom? Said this. He said he went to prom in Philly. He said he took the, but he's saying he took the bitch to prom. So he was in tenth grade and she was in twelfth grade. Yeah, you... bro, like, come on now, bro. Like, bro, right. listen, bro. Even if you, bro, listen, right? Okay, bro, why, why does this, why does it say that you were a part of the high Q team in 2015, the year you graduated, which would have been your senior year? Bro, wait, 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 wait. right? Bro, listen, right? Bro, hey, right? Bro, bro, bro right? Right, look though, right, but that, listen, right, but look, but that exact same yearbook, that exact same yearbook, right? It, it shows that yo, I was a junior, and that's when I left. But I thought you said sophomore is when you left. Yeah, you, 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 no, 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 no. Hey, right, bro, right, look, right, so look. You caught it. It's, it's from eighth to tenth grade, right? And um, tenth grade is sophomore. Right, right. It's from eighth grade to tenth grade, right? In junior year, I fucking left that bitch, right? But niggas don't have no proof to say that, one, I graduated from Penwood. That's not true, bro. I never graduated from that school, right? Fletcher say he got graduation picks. Isn't that the alumni class Joe. right there? Bro, 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 listen, mm -hmm. bro, that's cap, right? It says Penwood High School, school alumni right, bro, 2015, like, bro, bro. Like, again, bro, is that, everything about my life that I've shown... 
from from again my my uh, parents this. Why are these people making this shit up then? Like Flacco, why are these people lying on you then? Huh? Why are these people lying on you? Bro, listen, right? Here, bro, so when I got the car right earlier today, right? And they said one, bro, like, we feel like you should be repping us harder. And, and like, right, and it, 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 you know, right? It, here, right? So, so, so Joe, I'm not sure why Joe, you know. Right, but when I got called earlier, is yo, bro, like, I feel like you should be repping us harder. And, but, bro, like, I never, like, not rep them niggas, right? It, 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 it's just, bro, like, I spent the majority of my life in Fargo. That's where I'm from. I don't understand, like... Can you get, can you get, do you have any like, pictures? Do you have any pictures from your high school in Fargo? Yeah, bro. You feel me? Right, 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 but here. If he was in 10th grade in 2015, that means that he would have graduated high school in 2017. What year did he take her to prom? What year did he take her to prom? Yeah, what, what, what year did you take Shorty to prom? Huh? What year did you take Shorty to prom? Uh, I came back in 2015. And what, how you old were you in? came back in 2015. How old were you in 2015? What grade were you in in 2015? What grade was he in in 2015? Joe Fletcher saying he knows someone that went to elementary school with you in in Philly, bro. Bro, bro, wait, 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 wait. I dare any nigga, bro. He's on the phone with him right now. I got, I got, I got a fan blowing me up right now. Tripping super hard. Could you put your number on Facebook? I have an actual. This dude is. I'm about to block his shit. In first grade, in West Fargo. You had a storm, man. I'm gonna answer this guy's call real quick. Hold on, hold on, Flacco. Hold on. Hey. Hello. Now he got the show live. Hang on. Hello. You live? You want you want you want no jumper? Who is this? Yo. You want no jumper? What's up? Hey yo, this nigga flock a line, bro. Who are you? What's your name? Where you from? This nigga flock a line, bro. Who is this? Cause he had that bitch last night. He was cheating on her last night. What? Bro, this is getting weird, bro. Did they post your number? <laughs> my number must. I'm, my my shit's your, getting blown up right now. Leaked? My phone number leaked. Who leaked your phone number? Is the nigga? Put your phone on. Do Can't, not disturb. I'm about to in a second. This guy, this guy keeps calling me from motherfucking Europe. Who is this? You, oh my god. You are no jumper. What's up? Oh my god. Hey, y'all niggas real weird for what you doing, bro? How come? Man, you can handle this shit with burning you offline, bro. Come on now. You sound like a bitch. <laughs> Damn, he hung up. I'm Put bad. your phone on. Do not disturb. It's the last. This is the last call we taking. Who, who, who this? Who this? You live on no jumper? I'm taking calls like OG suicide today. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, loved one. This is OG Suicide. Who's this? Did they post your number? <laughs> My number must have been posted. The probably Joe. What is weird now? This shit crazy. Got, probably got you <laughs> up. This yes. shit crazy, yo. <laughs> Joe running this shit up. <laughs> All, right. All right. He's not gonna answer the qu- questions at this point. You um, took your girl to prom in 2015. That means that he would have graduated high school in 2017 if he was in 10th grade in 2015. Or if you if you graduated in 2015 and you took your girl to prom, that means that she's underage. Look, I know that. He's cat. Here, when I first look, I'm the type of person that I really, if I'm around you and I have to be around you every day, mm-hmm. I'm gonna consider you fam eventually. And I think I kind of made that. What's up? Let let me just get yep. through this right here. All right. Yep. Let me get through this. This nigga number posted. He bled himself. That's why he's not <laughs> tripping. 
Is, is, my, is my shit on the Reddit? Is that what that is? Oh, okay. Damn, I'm getting all kinds of calls. We got Lance in Michigan. <laughs> I'm going to call jo- Joe Fletcher. I'm about to call you in a few, but don't even trip. Put your phone on D&D. Damn, I've had this number for a few years. I'm going to have to change this bitch now. <laughs> San Diego in the house. <laughs> this guy's... <laughs> Airplane mode, all right? Instagram. Airplane mode. This shit getting crazy, fool. Now, like I was saying, like I was saying, I kind of made the mistake in thinking that all of us were a lot closer than we were. I thought we was a family. Um, and I your number is definitely on your Instagram. I kind of had to recalibrate right. the way I look at things. Almighty's been my homie for since he was a little ass kid, mm-hmm. right. fresh out diapers. Like that's right. that's my dog. You feel mm-hmm. me? And I consider people at No Jumper homies, but I had to recalibrate the way I look at things. Now I don't believe that anyone at No Jumper would lie to this extent. That's wild as. And it kind of, and I can't really like respect it if someone's been lying. Now, I'm not saying he's lying, but this shit don't look good. Mm-mm. Yeah, and it's like at this point, nigga, you're pretty much. But it's so, so for lying. people, so for people to act like we're doing something out of pocket by trying to dissect this, that like, nigga's out of pocket for fucking lying, bro. Or... Not only were not only were we asked by the producers of the show to do this, mm-hmm. but like we're supposed to like our whole entire relationship with each other is predicated on what we're telling and honesty like mm-hmm. we all know like you where i went to motherfucking nursery school preschool elementary high school you feel me middle school it's all on record i'm still with the same homies that i've had from the sandbox mm-hmm. you see me with him to this day mm-hmm. right the homies from the fives all that shit that been my homies since i was a, a baby mm-hmm. we grew up together so I don't just know. think it's just up here lying. That shit's crazy as fuck. But when you come right? on a platform and create a facade and you create this um, identity or alias and you tell us who you are and we really don't know who you are and all we know is you're an innocent kid from North Dakota and they come to find out that you grew up in Philly just a little bit. Uh, I don't like, really... Go ahead. No, keep going. I don't this really is, know what to... What is that? This is insane, bro. You got I'm, something else? No, my, my whole, first of all, Joe Fletcher really wants to talk again. So we Hold should on. call, we're going to call Joe Fletcher back. I think this is just crazy. Like, why are you, what is, what are you hiding in Philly that made you need to lie about all this? It's just so unnecessary to me. I and Joe understand. also told us that it was a light skinned shorty that he was in love with it or whatever that was, you know, spending all his dough. The girl that's in that prom picture is dark skinned. Mm. So, but why did he fly back just to take her to, to prom? You feel me? Yeah. Right. Now, if he went to, if he graduated in 2015 and he went to prom in 2015 and she also went to prom in 2015, it makes sense for him to go back. Yeah. But that's not, that the, that description that Joe gave us of the girl that was taking his money is not the same girl that's in that video. That's not, I mean, that picture, that's not the same description. Yeah, that shit is crazy to me. I just don't understand. Something had to happen to make that, that's making him try to just act like Philly never existed in his yeah. life. Okay, we call, in Joe, we call in Joe Fletcher. Did he send you any new pictures? He says he, he's 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 coming with new info. What's jo- up, Joe? You hot? Joe, what's going on, man? What's up? What's up? Hold on, I'm about to, I'm about to call my man Mikey and shit. Cause he 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 the one who went. He knew Frederick before or something great and shit. He went to elementary school with him. Oh. oh. We, oh, she said he was in North Dakota. We going to chop it up with him he said tomorrow. He so we going to be with Flacco in person tomorrow. Oh, shit. Woo. Shit, man. You hey, got to mute gotta, your YouTube. Yeah, you got to mute your YouTube, homie, yeah, you please. you got to mute it. Oh, uh, I'm turning it down. My bad. Hold on. Yo, my phone. This is insane, bro. Yeah, take your fucking you gotta put your phone Instagram. on. Do not disturb. I, I did. It's on. Do not disturb. But it's still like change the setting to nobody can get through. Okay. Yeah, Let me tell you unknown where it numbers. Is. You gotta silence unknown callers. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Yeah. I got my man Mikey. Yo, Mikey, talk your shit, bro. Talk, talk, tell him. Yeah, that nigga flock. Yeah, that nigga. His name is. Yeah, he's cap. Frederick is from Darby, Pennsylvania. I went to elementary school with him. Nigga, your fourth grade math teacher, Mr. Howard, bro. Fifth grade, Mr. Williams. Shouts to Mr. Williams. 
Okay, we're not going to sit here and care. But I fuck with Frederick, though. I don't know why he's saying from North Dakota, but he's definitely from Delaware County, for sure. I don't know. I don't know what, what he got going on. Oh, that North Dakota. He, I know he moved there after high school when he graduated and went to college. This is you know insane. Yeah, yeah, he stayed. I ain't never known him for coming back. Yeah, he stayed. Okay, do you have any pictures of elementary school, Flacco? Matter of fact, I'm following an elementary school teacher on Facebook. Not they gonna call the teacher. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, I'm following an elementary school teacher on Facebook. I had that nigga text right me a headset right in on his job. Here. That's oh, crazy. Hey, Gene, can you do it real quick? That's crazy. Yeah, this shit off the chain. He's still on the phone, Gina, so you can See, about. why is he still lying? Talking about he really from North Dakota, but then he moved to Philly, and then he went back to North Dakota. Oh my It's still coming through? God. Yeah. Keep going. I'm going uh, to look at it. It's all good. got to go to callers. So, uh, all right. Silence we, unknown callers. We, we um, So you 100% grew up. So was it kindergarten through sixth grade? What years did you go to school with Flacco? I met Frederick in, was it, it was either third or fourth grade. I know for sure our fourth grade math teacher was Mr. Howard. Fifth grade, Mr. Williams. Sixth grade, Miss Anthony. Okay. Straight from there, we went to middle school, seventh and eighth grade. That's when we all met each other, Joe and all of us. What was he like at that point? Uh, was always cool. He wasn't. He was always cool. He stayed in his lane. He always stayed. He was cool. It wasn't nothing, nothing. I don't, that's why I said I don't know why he claimed North Dakota. I don't know what that's about. But he was always cool. <laughs> hey, this is the craziest thing. Ever. Yeah, yeah, this shit is off the chain. This, this is, is crazy. Good podcasting. Bro, what the fuck? All right. Why would he lie? What happened? What did y'all do to him in Philly? Yeah, y'all, yeah, what did y'all do to like, fuck this guy's makes, head up? Is it really the bitch that makes him not want to claim Philly? To me, for me to know that he would have to move away and claim something I never know him doing anything to get in anything like that. So I don't know why he Isn't it normally people from places like North Dakota lie and say they from Philly? Not the other way around? <laughs> nah, real rat. I don't know why he's doing that though. I don't know what that's about. Where he at? Did he want to call? I want to talk to him. I want to know why he's acting like that. Should Joe. I call him? Wait, call Joe. Him. No, call no, 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 no that, that, that's that's Mikey. Yeah, that's call Mikey. Him. Wait, but the the girl in the picture is that the girl y'all said he was taking? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, the girl in the picture is that this? Is the girl in the picture the girl that y'all said was milking him for his money on the prom picture that y'all sent? Put in the mic. Call him. Let's, okay. Let's see if right, he denies right. the elementary school we, we, shit. We're going to get to the bottom of this elementary school thing real quick. Because <laughs> he said 7th I'm calling Flacco. To 10th. He, 7th to 10th is crazy. From third grade. That's crazy. He's taking more calls than OG suicide in this motherfucker. This is crazy. We ain't even going to talk about nothing else. This is the whole episode. This is made. <laughs> I just got paid what, for nothing. This is beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do anyways that's so crazy <laughs> what do you mean <laughs> fuck you <laughs> alright Flacco we gonna merge the call hold on alright 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 all right. Flacco's here Fla hold on hold on Fl Flacco we got Mikey we got Mikey on the phone from who says, third grade <laughs> <laughs> For, from Mr. Williams class and Mikey. Mikey, he's saying who? He, he's saying he don't know you. No, 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 no. Which Mike? What's your last name, bro? This is. Man, I'm not about to expose my name. Michael Jeffrey. You don't know me. Bro, Michael. Man, come on, bro. Nigga, if we just talk like what? What? For like uh, 
for like two hours ago. You don't know me, Frederick? Because I got pictures of when they was just doing loot and shit, nigga. He was asking me to send you videos so you could post, and that was two years ago. Yeah, bro, yeah, for two years. Yeah, bro, listen to me, right, bro. So you don't know me in four years. We talked two hours ago, nigga. We talked two hours ago. Like the birthday, we talked two. Bro, we talked two hours ago. Maybe they had the same. Hold on, hold on. Answer this question, then I'm going to hang up. Man, you didn't have the same fourth grade teacher? Hell nah, bro. So you didn't go to Walnut Elementary School. You didn't have Mr. Howard. Bro, hell, bro, hell, bro. What about Mr. Williams? <laughs> <laughs> Do the funky Frederick. Like, do the like, funky I, Frederick. I don't live by that candy like I don't even do this. Bro, 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 like, bro, bro, listen, bro, wait, right, but bro, like, again, bro, like, this is the same, bro, like, you can't even call bro, me your bro. bro no more, bro. You tell the motherfuckers you don't know me, bro. Oh! <laughs> Damn, Mikey! I'm elementary school, bro, stop passing. And before you even went to Walmart, nigga, you went to Kyle Wynn Elementary. He said, he said, he said third grade. He said third grade. He said third grade. Don't he sound like Meek Mill kind of? <laughs> Hold on, wait a minute. Y'all, I was... <laughs> When I bought that SMR and y'all thought it was ready. <laughs> <laughs> Philly is a dope place to be from. Send the yearbook pictures, Flacco. The, yeah, send the send the pics, Flacco. How much you want to bet right now? If I go on Instagram, I mean Facebook right now, and tag Mr. Williams and ask Mr. Williams for his phone number, he'll tap in his car and say you was his student. How much you want to bet? And that was your fifth grade teacher. We can bet right now. Oh, he's gone. He, he left. He just left. He left. Oh yeah, he know. Yeah. He know. Yeah. He know. He know. He left. Wow. Yeah, he hung up, bro. Yeah, he lost. Yeah, nigga, he can't, bro. I don't even do that, but he just started doing all that line talking about he don't know me, nigga. We go way back, nigga. That's crazy. So you've known him from third grade and up? Bro, I know Frederick from elementary school. That's my guy. For all that other shit, y'all talking about, I don't know nothing about that. But where he's from, I know for sure. Where, nigga, I grew up with him from elementary school. We from the same place. Did he, did he ever mention, did you ever hear anything about North Dakota with him before that? No, I knew Fred, listen, I knew Freddie was in North Dakota when all that loot and shit was going on down here in Philly. He told me to send him videos and some shit. He was trying to post, I don't know what he was trying to do with him. I knew he was down here for school, though. I never knew mm. ever in my life of Frederick being in North Dakota. And that was what, college? So he went to college and tried to act like he was. That's why he has that accent, because he was raised in Philly. And that makes so much more sense, because, because he never on, sounded like a North Dakota. He's from down this way. And then for him to lie and just say he don't know me, 
I dismantled him. He's a, that shit blew my mind. I'm cool off man, man. I'm, I don't even want to talk to him. But I'm exposing him every chance I get. If y'all go look on Facebook, all his classmates is in the comments grinding him up. Every even even security guards from the schools is grind. Everybody's grinding him up on Facebook. If y'all want to go check it out. Yo, 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 we can we can get the security guard in this motherfucker. Let, let, give give a little tape and shit, bro. Shit crazy. Damn, he a nut ass freak bull. <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck is that? That's what the Philly fools be saying. Oh hey, you know that's freak bull. What? <laughs> hey, I appreciate. I, one of them say I appreciate y'all time. Thank you very much. Um, if any, Mikey, anything you want to shout out? Any people you want to shout out before? Uh, he already hung up. He hung up already. Okay. Up All right, Joe. We appreciate you, homie. Right, right. No problem. What the fuck just happened? This has been um, a very, very interesting way to start off <laughs> the no Jordan year drama. Jordan year. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck just happened, y'all. Oh my god! But it just happened. Damn. I don't know what just happened, but it just did. I guess this explains why he liked to see niggas and Tim's having sex. Facts, because he's a Philly nigga. Yes. This makes so much his accent. It just explains everything. Mm -hmm. Because I always was trying to figure out how does a nigga from North Dakota sound say, say, hey, yo, hey, yo, yeah, so yeah. much. What nigga in North Dakota says, hey, yo? I think they, don't they be like, howdy? I don't, <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't fucking know. I don't know what they say. Yeah, I'll That's tell you right now. North Dakota? You know, the oh. hard, no, the hardest fools in North Dakota guarantee are natives. They have to There's be. for sure some native gangs right. on the reservations native that are American active as fuck. That's I guarantee. Like, so shouts to the natives yeah. holding it down in North Dakota. Like, I know y'all out there. I know crazy. niggas are not talking about AOB, where that niggas and Tim's porn be. Like, <laughs> nah, my nigga. Like, nobody in North Dakota is doing that, bro. Like, oh my God. And, and then what's crazy is, on oh God, we would have we been trying to, 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 to at least give you the benefit of the doubt if you didn't try to hang me and Jenna up to dry yeah. on the motherfucking cross. We I mean, probably would have This is not. Th this has nothing to do with vengeance. It doesn't, but I'm just saying, maybe we would have tried to defend you a little bit, but hey, by all means, it's no holds barred. This and has look, nothing to do with so us. So to be fair... Our hands are tied. To be fair, he is sending me pictures of his license, of his... Um, What's this? But just because you, but, but it, it, all of that shit can be but made. Yeah, yeah, and no, but and that. it doesn't, it doesn't say his birthday. Like he has his birthday bl blurred out, and I got my because he doesn't want people to really find out the oh, hospital yeah. he was born in was probably really in Philly. That's why. Why does he keep hiding it, bro? You can Google my name and my birthday right now. You can Google it. The fact that he's sending it to you and he's still hiding stuff is questionable. Because it's only going to you. You're not going to send it to the right. fucking Reddit no, or no, the post or anything. No. So if he's sending it to you Look, and he's still blurring shit out and still hiding things, hide. that's very questionable. I'll, I'll be honest, hide. guys. Like, and this is for all y'all watching. There's way worse shit that we're just not even talking about. Like, we're not talking about any of the legal shit. But Facts. but they found it before we even you know discovered it. Facts. We're not going to unpack it though. No. Facts. No. We well, only he thing. can because we really don't know too much. You know about yeah. it, but regardless, we found some shit earlier that was very, very like, "Hey, what's going on?" Because hey, you, yo, when hey, you yo. sent in to take no jumper down, like, what's? I don't know what's going on. What's going on? The no jumper Rico is, is coming. Bro. You ever look at your coworkers like, damn, they just hire anybody? Man, you know, you just look <laughs> at these niggas and be like, Dude, I don't even know you anymore. Do I I'm even scared. know you? Like, I'm scared. I don't know what's gonna happen niggas. when when we walk out to our car. We don't know if niggas' names is Frederick or Minyango Tokba. <laughs> we don't know who niggas is, bro. This shit crazy. Yo, this shit ain't straight. It, bro, this shit is really like reality TV, yo. Bruh. They call sure me God. Minyango with the guapo. That shit was crazy. So two things that we do know to be consistent is that he does get finesse for his money by bitches. Facts. We don't have any confirmed kills, a.k.a. we don't know that... If he fucked anything. Yeah. No, confirm no confirmed bodies. No, no, no confirmed kills. None, but he definitely has confirmed per uh, purse purchases. Definitely, because he know when them nature. Teflar bags drop. 
every drop. He buying them for somebody. He know the day, so somebody's getting them. Damn, is it the same shorty? Hey. No, it's some dude named like Bashar, and he's got a catfish account. It's a dude account. named uh, Fox nigga named Akbar yeah. somewhere. Nah, y'all, it <laughs> got to be the same shorty in a, Philly. A nigga named Akbar in the Indian office typing through it. To hey, do a fucking screen. Whoever Shorty is in Philly, she sounds like a bad John. Yeah, because they said she was like hot. Yeah, but she also sounds like she finessing this guy. Yes. Factuals. Sucks yeah. for Flacco. So fuck that bitch. Yeah, fuck that bitch. Fuck that little thought. Hey, don't finessing. hate the player. I'm, I, I hate the player. Hate the game. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Get the, your money, bitch. Yeah, you know. Get the bag. Nah, bitch. if anything, she got to You got to teach your homies to fight back, nigga. She gotta teach bag. your homie to squabble next time. Get she, the bag. She got to send. She got to send a, a little piece of that to the gang one time. She got to send a hundred percent of that. Bitch, that bitch not breaking. One hundred and ten percent. She been. You know. She been. Watching, Tear it off. She been watching this. Put it in my hand. Jesus. She been watching us talk about him for all these months. That's and she crazy. Just reaping the benefits. Who was poetic? Flacco was really a topic for today. So tomorrow, that's my on the news. It's me, suspect, and Flacco. Doom, doom, doom. How, much you, how much you want to bet you don't show up because I'm there? Mm. Didn't go come? It's his job. What that mean? He didn't want to get on the phone today. Adam told him to. Didn't go come? Yeah. Mm. I literally, look, I'm going to be honest. I only wanted to do this after, like, I mean, I didn't have a choice to do it, but I only agreed to do it because I was trying to like hoping he would defend himself or come clean and be like yeah I'm really from out there right. I just didn't want anyone to know yeah. about you know I would have been like all right you kind of weird but this actually that if he would have said that that actually would have ended things about instantly a hundred and uh mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but then he lied on top of it. Then he keeps lying right now. Yeah. And yeah. then he still even lied about the other shit. I never said that about Gina. Yeah, I do look him in the eye. I don't know if you seen the episode where they called him out about him not looking me in the eye. He was like, no, I didn't see that. That's the cap. It's like, I don't have no problem with Flacco. Flacco apparently has a problem with me because whenever he sees me, he don't look me in the eye. But I'm like, I don't have no fucking problem with Flacco. But you, nigga, this is Chestnut Checkers. And, Yo, queen has already been knocked off the table, sir. Damn, this guy wants to run the fade for Flacco. Who? He want to fight us? Who he want to fight? I don't know. Should I call him? Go ahead. <laughs> Eastside Londale in the building. All right, <laughs> let's, let's. Not Londale. <laughs> we taking calls. If y'all got a legend number, call. The person you are trying to reach has a voicemail box that has not been. Damn, fool, where you at? His phone off. Yeah, if he would have, um, I feel like if he would have just been honest to... from the beginning of the the show, then it probably would have all been canceled out. Yeah. We wouldn't it's even be here line. at 721. That's crazy, bro. We almost roasted you for two hours from your lies. Yeah. This is insane, my nigga. Get it together, bro. So is the verdict in? The, the verdict? Is he cap or not? Cap is fuck. Damn, some bitch sending me your pussy and it's... Really weird looking. Lush, Ew. what's the verdict? Let me see. Cap or no? I mean, <laughs> who are you calling now? Calling the same guy. What's up, Eastside Lawndale? Where you at? Yeah, he don't want to talk. All right, we spent a lot of time on Poetic Flacco. <laughs> Shout out to that man. Uh, prayers up to him. Let's go ahead and get into some time. <laughs> there prayers up to that nigga like he did. <laughs> we gotta, yo, Flacco has had, like, let's be honest, he's had a rough 60 days. <sighs> okay, okay. He's had a rough 60 days. He said prayers up. We like gotta that pray for that man. Prayers With that being that said, um, I don't want to go right into a serious topic. Oh, no, we can go in the we can go in the Yo Gotti and Angela yeah, let's Simmons. talk about that. Yeah, Yo Gotti and Angela Simmons. What he say on down down in the DMs was that 2016? 2016. 2016. I got a crush on Angela, Angela Simmons. Simmons. Yeah, I just followed it. Angela Simmons. I got a crush on Angela Simmons. And then what happened? Cuffed. Six years later, Cuffed. I I kind of knew because hmm. we would see. Is he 20 years older than her? Or am I tripping? 
Uh, no. Nah. Well, they're the same age. Uh, nah, he's older brothers. than her, but... Yeah, I like, don't think they're the same age. I, I want to say she's early 30s, he, he's late 30s, mid 30s. Oh, okay. mm-hmm. They're not, it's not like anything egregious. Yeah. Oh, okay. But, um, I know that they were posting, She like, she was posting things, like, at, at the same, they were both in Dubai at the same time. They were both, like, at the Eiffel Tower at the same time. Mm-hmm. There was, a, he posted on his Instagram, like, driving in, like, a dirt bike th- or, like, a ATV thing in Dubai. Yeah. And then she had, like, the same thing on her story, but, mm-hmm. like, from another angle. Mm-hmm. So, I mean, we were kind of, uh, this was going to be confirmed yeah. for the past week or two. And... Good for you, Yo Gotti. You're killing Absolutely. the game. CMG going crazy. Yes. You up in the score. You about to be a Simmons, yes. a.k.a. Nef- uh, a son-in-law of Russell, potentially. Yo Gotti. That's money right there. Yo Gotti is definitely doing his doing his big one. He doing some big shit. This is absolutely freaking phenomenal. When I seen it, I hit the group chat. Super fucking excited. I tweeted about this. I was just so happy. If, if T.I. is like a Southern Jay-Z... What, who is, is he the new Southern Jay-Z? Is it Yo Gotti now? I think Yo Gotti is Yo Gotti. But like, yes, fair enough. But like, he's really up in the bracket with all this. Oh, he definitely upped the score. I mean, beyond all the signees, everyone he's put on, yeah. like him being a great boss, yes, still making solid music. Mm-hmm. He's got like he got a record from some years back called Concealed. I still slap. I fuck with Yo Gotti, mm-hmm. but this and remember look, Shorty ride or die. If she sober, high, she know just what to do to help the gangster. I think Yo Gotti's a better businessman than he is a rapper, but I think he's doing his thing regardless. All, all that to say, Dolph was way tighter than Yo Gotti. Eh. I really wasn't a fan of either, so I, I, I can't fu- speak on that. I fucked with but Dolph. I, I think Yo Gotti's a really good businessman, though. He's really business savvy. He's about his bread. He got his whole label cracking with the artists and all that shit. So he's definitely business savvy doing his thing. And sometimes business savvy is better than just being musically inclined because he's going to last longer. Question. No, for sure. If y'all shoot y'all shot at a shorty in 2016, but you don't bag her until 2022, are you wifing her? We don't know if he did. He could have been smashing this whole time. Facts. He could have hit back then. Facts. We just know that now. Because, you know, fans, people always wait until they get to tell them the real what they're doing anyways. Well, so they could have been fucking undercover for who knows how long. But let's revisit the timeline. Because remember, um, she was a virgin. She had never had sex that, before. Wasn't that way before then? But remember her baby daddy. She got in a, a very serious relationship and yeah. then got pregnant and her baby daddy um, passed away. Right. Mm. R.I.P. to that, man. Uh-huh. Um, I know she rich as hell. Yeah, I'm unfamiliar with that whole situation. I'm not positive. Yeah. What was what was her... Uh, but are y'all waiting from 2016 she, to She was like a virgin when she had down. like... She was a virgin when yeah. she had like pastry shoes and no, all I that. No, I think like, she was an adult Is it virgin? really waiting okay. if you've been smashing bitches the whole time and then you finally just come across her? That's not really waiting. Waiting is if you saving yourself for a bitch. It's not really waiting mm. if you just living your life, fucking bitches, and then you finally come across her. That's not waiting. He was just living his life. But are you going to continue to be consistent? No, not, not for and you. And to get I'm, in that relationship. I'm sure he wasn't. Wait a he second. probably just seen her somewhere. Wait a second. On the song, <laughs> Got That Sack, he said, um, what did he say? Like, bad hoe, yellow bone, I was hitting it from the back. Maybe... He was talking about Angela Simmons. No, he wasn't. Because that was before then anyway. But <laughs> <laughs> I see where you was going though. So y'all know who's next to bag somebody who they mentioned in the song? Who that? Meek Mill. Who he shout out now? Lori Harvey. Yeah. Mm. I can see that. Did he bag her? No. No. Didn't Future already do that? Future fuck everybody, bitch. <laughs> and daughter. Is right. game gonna get Karuchi? I feel like that's very feasible. Did he do? Didn't he do that already back in the day? No, he name dropped her on the song. Oh, he pretty, is, he pretty much. You. Is it Karuchi? Karuchi's what? 24? 25? Is I she don't older think now? She's that young. She's older now. I think she's older. Because games like my age. Facts. So it's your. You, but I mean, he do be fingering young bitches in the park. It's kind of crazy. <laughs> that's a sick response. Okay. He Who is Karuchi? Oh, she old. Karuchi's she look good as fuck. Yeah. Damn. I thought she was way younger. She looked fire. Yeah, Karuchi bad I think bad game copied what Chris Brown said in a song. I got a little bitch that like, like Karuchi. Yes, you do. Yeah, I do, huh? Absolutely. 
Because I like her. <laughs> you said that one shorty looked like her. I got a little bitch that looked like she her. She looked like her for sure. I do. She looked like her. I don't think you've seen her. I'm, I'm on your close friends. I do. Yeah, you know what's going on. Um, so it is the top of the new year. And as we know, every year, Uncle Murder does a wrap-up, an end-of-the-year wrap-up. And I listened to it this morning, and I said, damn, y'all, we didn't talk about Will Smith and Chris Rock when we did our last episode in 2022. Crazy. Yeah. He covered everything. Yeah. Uncle, Uncle Murder understood the assignment. Um, I was always a fan of skills doing it back in the day. Uh-huh. And... um. I like how he would like choose a relevant topical beat that was popping at the time and just, but it was like, he wouldn't go that in depth. It would just be quick little punchlines. Mm-hmm. I feel like murder like goes more in depth with it. And um, I'm just a fan of Uncle Murder. I think he's one of the most hilarious dudes yeah. in hip hop. I liked all the shit he was doing with Mano. I liked the Cameron voice joint. Um, he could have, I feel like uh, there was a time where it was like, who's gonna be the next 50? And at first they were saying like it was gonna be Saigon, that never happened. Mm-hmm. Then they was talking about Uncle Murder and uh Uncle Murder, Mano, and uh Casanova. I've all heard potentially going into that role mm-hmm. of like a big bully in New York. Like that's cause a lot of like the dudes that are scary in New York now, they're like young ass kids that mm-hmm. just have guns that are bigger Facts. than half their body mass. Mm-hmm. But these like huge, like alpha male type dudes that are bullying people in New York. I, I thought that um, there was a definite trajectory for Uncle Murder, but hmm. him, I was, I'm Vado, hella, Omeno. I'm hella just... unfamiliar with Uncle Murder. I ain't gonna lie. Do you fuck with New York music like that, though? Not really. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Mm, that's yeah. probably why. Yeah, I'm not familiar with Uncle Murder. Do you fuck with New York drill? Mm, not really, bro. I don't know. I'm not really a fan of them UK-ass beats. So it's kind of hard for me to... Yeah, I don't like that shit. Yeah, I fucks with it. I, I, like, really, I like Brooklyn and I Bronx like The only New York kind of drill song that I like is one that's from somebody out here. 500 Racks did like a New York drill beat, and it was fire. I think Ralph, I played it for you, Gina. Ralphie's yeah. done it too. That, that shit fire. I ain't go... Sp- yeah, that's cool too. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah. like, you feel me? Like, I'm not really a, a, a fan of the... New York drill thing. But not saying that it's like trash or nothing. Mm-hmm. That's just not what I like to listen to. No, I fuck with it. It's definitely an acquired taste. Mm-hmm. But, you know, I, just because I love sh- like Chirac music. Was yeah, such that's a- what I'm saying. I was so big on Chicago's scene and they drill shit that I like. To me, that's real drill. And if it don't sound like that, I can't really. But I'm they okay. took it to like the next level. They've upped the score like Practice. really. And I'm tired of hearing niggas yelling in songs and shit. So it's like I'm over it. I was listening to Chief Keef and King Yellow and all them type of niggas screaming into the beat eight years ago. So I don't really want to hear that shit no more. And, and they and, it was and they ten years now. And they weren't even screaming like that. I mean, some like, of them was. Sometimes like Duck Rondo would scream. Number Nine was screaming. Rondo his would ass scream. Off. Some of them niggas were screaming their ass off. Young Pat. We off them zips. Them niggas were screaming their ass off. Like you feel me? <laughs> See, I fuck with uh, East Coast music based off of like just the bars and shit. I like the rap, rap, rap shit. And I that's feel that of, that that's a dying art in the East Coast, right? Well, now. well, like some of them drill dudes are crazy. Like two two Gs, like yeah, he got crap. hella bars and punches, mm-hmm. and they're flipping like those styles. There's there's a lot of dudes that dude coach the ghost. Um, there, there there's some dope. It's some York, of them, but yeah, yeah. mainly they just talking about smoking on ops and doing shit like that. Well, definitely. Well, I, I think it's just the beats, though. It's not even so much the accent, just the beats. When they use different beats, I can fuck with it. But Pop Smoke was hard as a motherfucker, though. Pop Smoke was hard. Pop was hard. Do, definitely. Do y'all hard. hear that? Yeah. Somebody's car got broken into. I only hear it in the headphones, though. Anyways. Um, but yeah, um, New York, I mean, not New York, uh, Uncle Murder wrap up is definitely something that I'm waiting for every year at the end of the year to come. And he actually does. There's not much else going on besides, like, as yeah. I would like to see like, him fill the space in between the New Year's. But I wonder what his um, process actually looks like as far as like, is he's. Is he notating things as it happened throughout the year, or does he just remember all? Because remember how complicated it was for us when we were sitting there trying to figure out what happened all throughout the year, so we could talk about it. So I wonder what his process looked like. He might go to different media sources, like Year in Review or Best of Twenty Twenty Two, and just okay, or he and could just be make just like a little compilation. 
he could be writing shit down as it comes. His joints are way longer than like skills would just be like a regular four yeah. or five minute song. Like this dude's His rapping in, in depth, long. Yeah. So since we got the two rappers at the office here, uh, can you guys tell us what is this No Jumper mixtape looking like? It's gonna be fun. We ain't did it yet. I don't know. We ain't got there yet. I guess we're supposed to start recording soon, but you know I don't know shit about it yet to be honest. But when I do know, I'm gonna be in that motherfucker for surely. But they, I, th- I think they said something about like in the next week or so they'll have an engineer or something. I'm not for sure. I don't know the. Who's um, executive a- producing this? The project? analytics. I don't know, but I do know that I for sure have several engineers that would be down to pop up. I know all of us got engineers, producers, whatever. Most definitely. So. I think they said that they have one though, but we're gonna see. It's film. Sure. It's being recorded here. Yep. Ooh. Yep. So I mean, y'all gonna be like taking shots at each other? Y'all gonna be gassing shit up? Like, are I don't y'all think like, so, but like, what I are y'all? I think that's what we're doing. I think we're just making. Y'all just make. Are y'all trying to make a hit that's gonna get played on the radio type shit, or is it just I like we putting together a project because we all rap and we got access to a studio? I think we just gonna see like how it go. But yeah, yeah like, because I know me, I don't, I don't like rapping with like, I don't like unless it's like. Uh, so unless I'm like mad, I don't like rapping with like topics. I just like to go in there and just do whatever the fuck I feel like. I think we finna just hit the booth and spaz. Yeah, I'm just going there and do what I feel like. So if y'all on a song with somebody and their verse is hotter than yours, are you gonna go back and ask to change your verse? That's lame. I don't think no niggas finna make me ever in my life do that. Mm. That's lame. Like honestly, you gotta. I used to make. I ain't gonna lie. I used to make a nigga who I used to rap with all the time when I first started. We all know what I'm talking about. He used to go rewrite his shit all the time after I would go record. He would redo his verses all the time. F- Fools be doing that. You I know his name. Yeah. We know his name. He know his name, too. I be yeah. looking down on that for the most part. I mean, if and let, but, I mean, there's really no rules. The only rule is make it hot. So if you need to do that and it winds up coming out fire, more yeah. power to you. So can somebody write me a 16 so I can hop on the... Easily. Ah, uh, Easily. Mate. It's <laughs> the first it bar. That's the first oh, bar. Oh fuck! I'm it. Niggas rap. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Don't I ever do that shit. Niggas. Do, 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 do. Yeah, it's Gina in my presence. It's a present, huh? Oh, oh my mm. god. Gina was <laughs> in there rapping, I got bro. Thicky, thicky, thick, huh? Why saw me Kwan wrote that? <laughs> Did Watson make you write it? <laughs> don't do that, bro. Don't fucking. Do Please that. don't do that. I'm don't. sorry. My Please. bad, Kwan. My bad. He <laughs> had to. Why would you do that? It just sounded like he wrote it. I don't know. <laughs> it was. It was meant to be. Uh, it was meant to be a troll. Gotcha. It was meant to, to troll. No, but you have you have a voice for it. I can see you having some shit. Yeah, me rapping is crazy though. You've been around it enough. Yeah, yeah. but like me. No, you gonna need look, you gonna need at least a twelve on the rhythm, project, bro. The only rhythm that Gina has is double dutching. Like, she doesn't have rhythm for anything else. She can't dance. None well, of Gina, I no, can't twerk. I can't braid hair. It's just. I can't do none of the normal. Are like, you sure you're not from North Dakota? I might be. She could do double that. <laughs> she could double that. But that's about I it. might be. South Central North Dakota. South Central North Dakota. Mm. Um, but there, there's. I think it'll be cool to see. Obviously, like AD Suspect, myself, mm-hmm. House Phone, T Rail. Um, everybody's got some shit. You know, like Blazy going going to get off. We gonna need it. We gonna need a. A little Adam 22, 12 bar. Yeah, we gonna Gina, need a, Gina, Gina views. How about Adam gets on there and bar all y'all up? Like, how are y'all gonna feel? Impossible. I don't think that's gonna Gina be. gonna host it. <laughs> you feel me? Nah, that, that's impossible. There's no way a white man who been riding bikes his whole life is finna get Nah, out I done heard Adam let some bars off. Bro, he's hilarious. Adam be having you got bars. Some freestyles. He's funny. You gotta think, if he's been doing what he's been doing in the media... But for as long gotta, as he's been doing it, he probably got bars stored. You got to mm. remember that. It ain't just about the bars, though, too. He has no rhythm. Like, them them finna be some of the stiffest bars we ever heard in our life. I, I want to hear Adam on, like, an auto-tune hook. <laughs> <laughs> that shit gonna stress me out. I don't want to hear that shit. Hey, did y'all see the shorty that, um... 
made a TikTok about how Drake flew her out and then kicked her oh, out. Oh, you crib. mean yeah? Then he said she was cap. You, know, I, I believe Drake. I'm inclined to believe Drake because he's got so many bad bitches. She, I mean, she was she low key like his. his type. She not yeah, she really. She was cute, does, but she, she didn't look, look like Drake. Like, she, type. She no, like that his type Drake is not flying a bitch like that. Out Drake likes stallions, and tall, she like light skin, thick. thick bitches. Yeah, that wasn't his type. I know multiple. And she don't look like that. Yeah, they you look. You know, they multiple bitches be, at Drake fuck. Yeah, they be light skinned and thick the majority of the time too. Me and Drake are Eskimo brothers, actually. Oh, yeah. Really? yeah. So you, and me and Wayne, you, you begin Drake me sloppy seconds. Um, so there's two of them. One of them, I'm the big Eskimo brother. The other one, I'm the little Eskimo. He brother. He fucked after you. On, once he did, yeah. Hmm. How did he meet her through you? No, not he didn't meet her through me. How do you know that y'all fucked the same girl? Because. She said so. Yeah, and this has been discussed. Bitches be lying. Did you too. double dip after no. Drake it? Well, one of them it's Drake and Wayne. So I'm Eskimo Brothers with Wayne and Drake. We know her? I'll tell you who it is. That's dirty. But I'll tell you who it is. It's up to you. But I'm not going to say it on here. Ah! Just, so, just in case you can get them draws again later? Oh, I just, I don't know how you feel. I'm not so trying to be celebrity? on TMZ or something. She's not a celeb. Come on, bro. We're not doing that. You should. If you're not trying to triple dip, you should say that shit. What if I am at some point in my life? That's I'm all I was. That's what I was getting to. You want to triple dip? Just say that. I, he want a triple dip, so he's not gonna say it. I ain't, we ain't. We ain't gonna put out no clues. Was it a threesome? No. I don't think Drake want to put his dick out in the same room as him. Is less. No. Yeah. I I, you think I want to pull my dick out <laughs> in the same room Hell as Drake? Yeah. You happy you, as fuck to hit the bitch out the track? You. So, so he, why, he, he hit one of them after why, me. <laughs> I, he was a little Eskimo brother. So how many what do you girls mean? is it? He didn't That's know. Two girls. <laughs> it's only two. That I know of. Yeah. So well, so Drake Drake is taking your leftovers. He did once. Mm. He did once. Was she hot? Mm. Uh, she's. They're both attractive. One of them is. Very attractive. They really Drake level? Because I know how Drake reeled her in, but how did you reel her that's in? That's crazy. That you, hey, that's how you know, hey, look, bitches at home, right? You know when bitches be fucking like a famous ass nigga, then they be like, yeah, like, I fuck Drake. Like, that's just the type of caliber of nigga that I need. And that's just the bitch. You can get fucked by Lush and Drake. So, so, no, and, and here's the thing. <laughs> I just want you to know that here's about the yourself. Thing. So, so, so one of them, so one of them, we were all partying together, and she... Partying or partying? We was doing the damn thing. We was at Boosie Bellows. We was at Drake's crib. Like, we was partying. You feel me? Like, mm. um, this is when I was, like, around Drake between 2011, 2014, 15. That's when I, like, I haven't really seen him much since Same then. time Flacco went to uh, Pinwood High. Ex same time. <laughs> so, exactly. He's Crazy. a class of 2015. Nice wow! Wow! Good frame of reference. Hey. Not, nah, but um, you'll understand. But when I tell you both, when we get off here, you'll be like, oh, "Okay, that makes sense." One Has of, he rapped about any of the girls? Allegedly, apparently, yes. What's He was real. I don't know, but apparently, he was really into one of them. And you, this is the girl that you hit before or after? Yes, you? before the other one, I hit after. Where do you know this girl from? If I say, it'll put it completely on blast, and everybody will be able to find out real quick. Oh, dang. Mm. So what, we got and, 15 and, minutes and, left? And the other one's known. <clears throat> Not known, but, like, known. So how did you bag her? Wasn't hard. She was a flip. She was, she was... Um, That's how you know, bitches. She was encouraging. Bullshit. She was encouraging. Were y'all hey. faded? Um... You know, I was always faded at that time. Can you fuck again? Um, probably not. The first one, I don't know. Um, at this point, she's like a little. She's like. Do she got veneers now? I need veneers now. Do she got veneers though? Because that's no, how you know if they, it's a new bitch. Or they're not. already like both attractive. They didn't need veneers. Mm. I they just already... want you niggas at home to know, right? When y'all be. Looking at your favorite celebrity like, damn, Lil Durk got that India bitch. Bro, Drake fucking the same bitches as Lush. You have a chance. And the thing is this. Look, I know I'm like a funny looking you ass. You have a chance. I know I'm a funny looking ass goofy dude. I'm not like under any illusions that I'm like the, the fucking man or anything. But for some reason, mouthpiece is a dangerous weapon. And I've it's been, facts. I've had nothing but bad bitches 
my entire life. You, I have a very my Pokemon collection. Charizard, I choose you. She gonna be bad every single time. I don't know how. It's literally personality, but because I know I look crazy, and I used to look. I, I didn't look as crazy as I do now. Like my teeth weren't as fucked up and shit. Suspect, Facts. suspect used to know when I was you feel me. Like I was like cute to bitches, like I would say. But yeah, hair. They, you feel he me? Was like fifteen pounds skinnier. Even though he was on hella drugs, you couldn't necessarily tell. Now you can tell he was on hella drugs because he right. looked different. But back then, he just looked like your typical white dude who was just living life. Mm. Yeah. Type shit. Yeah. Somewhat. But then, like, at a certain point, you'd be like, Then oh, you start this... looking smoked out. Yeah, you, th- th- this dude's on. You'd be like, oh, this nigga's in the middle of the battle rap grinding the fuck out his mouth. Yeah. He's high as shit. And yeah. really, like, I was taking a lot of ecstasy, doing a lot of coke. You yeah. feel me? Zan. So the so dick was crazy. crazy. He was going crazy. Allegedly. Yeah. Uh, Allegedly, yeah, good, I'm making them squirt. Good, good Percocet. Uh, good Percocet. Definitely making them squirt. Sometimes, look, I, I didn't show the couple bitches that they could squirt. Some was like, I didn't even know I could do that. You gotta hit that cervix. Yeah, you gotta really let them know sometimes. Y'all hitting the switch. You feel me? Like a six. Y'all turn in the f- yeah. like a six. Y'all turn in the switch. I on? didn't show like, like two bitches that they could squirt. Like they, they, and that's how you know, cause they be like, stop, stop, like I don't know what that is, and I'd be like, no, nah, bitch, move. I it's, know, I know what that yeah, is. So y'all getting peed on? Yeah, it, it is pee. Sure. It's pee. Y'all getting peed on? Yeah, it's, yeah it's, I like it for sure. Like what? Well, I, I like to get peed on. I, I prefer creamers to squirters. Yeah, but you, you got to like, do what you gotta do. That's how you know you really hit that bitch with some shit to where she didn't she have to do you. nothing. Like if she had to assist in the squirt, that's more so her. But if she just laid there and then you just made, you did your shit. You haven't really made a bitch come if you haven't made a bitch squirt. Facts. Like it's like there's levels Facts. to these orgasms. Is she Facts. having peed on you? If she hasn't peed it on you. It is what it is. It sounds like you're hating. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds like Gina hating. Sounds like Gina ain't squirting sound like, in a fat minute. It sounds like ain't nobody made Gina squirt yet. That's it all. It smell that like the Rome's thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Not stink. Yeah, I don't know about that. It, it sounds no. stitchy. No. Nah. It's that, it, it, there's a slight uh, aroma of urine. Very slight. Um, yeah, slight. Very slight, though, like, very slight. You ain't never squirted, Gina? No. Nah, that mean ain't nobody hitting Nobody's it right. Nobody's hitting it right, clearly. That's what that means. I don't want nobody to hit it right there. That mean nobody hitting it right. Oh. Nah, that's a different sensation from what I hear. Oh, it feel like something? Yeah, like, like that's like some crazy shit, like an explosion. That's the ultimate? Yeah. That's the ultimate orgasm? Yes. Ah. Yeah. There's levels. It's levels of this shit. Somebody got to put me on there, levels man. Yeah. I'm putting out applications. Yeah. She looking to squirt. I'm looking for a squirter maker. Mm-hmm. So y'all go. <laughs> y'all have it. She looking for a squirter maker? If you're a squirt inducer, yeah. yes. slide squirter in the DMs. Maker. If your but expertise is squirting. I guess they say squirting. every female can't squirt, though. Mm. But I'll tell you this: If, like you said, I fuck the same bitch as Drake, right? All right. Yeah. If you're, Does she pee on and, you? and I've already talked about this on Duno's podcast too. It, like, if I can fuck the same bitch as Drake, if Yo Gotti can get Angela Simmons, maybe a lame no jumper fan could get Gina views. Damn. To oh, squirt. a no jumper fan hitting them skins. Ooh. Ooh. I guess not a lame one. He'd have to be cool. All right. I don't know. Nah, Gina might like might, might like him lame. We don't know. If he from uh, Brooklyn, Jersey, he could be lame as fuck. As long as <laughs> oh, as long as I hear that voice, oh. you just you described Flacco. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that was coming. <laughs> uh, Brooklyn, Jersey. You hey, know. hey, you make N words rap. I make bitches squirt. Oh, you know I mean? Facts. it gets like that. If, if the towels don't work, we either. gonna have to bring them on the show. You, you, you know they got like specific like squirt towel that you can order off Amazon. Interesting, because the regular towels don't be working for me. What yeah, a Kleenex? Know, yeah, you, no, they <laughs> got, it absorbs. They got, yeah, it's like a sponge. Yeah, they got Tissue? absorbing squirt towels. Yeah, they have those. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm, you know, when you're making bitches squirt out here, sometimes you got to do a little research to figure it out because it'd be like, it ruined the whole night. Like, yeah. damn, bitch, I'm trying to go to sleep after this and now the whole mattress is just soaked and now I'm uncomfortable. Gina, Gina, keep it a stack. How many DMs daily are of dudes shooting their shot? Um, At least 10. No, I don't be having any. She don't be That's looking. cap. That's cap. No, they I don't be have any. Be no, there. no, you definitely do. They be I there. Don't. Check your message how, request. How, yeah. Is your message request off? Mm-mm, I don't know. Maybe Gina don't realize niggas is flirting when they flirting. I've I've actually been told. Oh, somebody said I make 
bitch a squirt. What's good, mamas? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Call me the squirt maker. Okay, Let's go. Man. <laughs> Let's go. I fucks with bro. Hey. That was fast. I know that's right. That Shout out to Mac Walker. Fast. Yeah. That nigga said he trying to make it. Shout out squirt. to the clone father one. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I make bitches squirt. What's hey, good, mommy? That nigga said he got to work fast. Hey, I know that's right. <laughs> that's funny as hell. Hey, this is comedy. Nah, but I don't be having people in my DMs like that. Yeah, you do. Yes, you I don't. Do. I've also been told though that um I bougie. that I am <laughs> You give off bougie vibes. Really? She she don't though. I'm definitely nah, a nigga. You, because we know her. She she's like off, the she's nah, like Nah, because look, right, the typical nigga that wanna fuck Gina live at live in his mama house and play PS5. But I feel like, so like but she's a, she's intimidating to a nigga who played PS5 and live in his mama really? house. Really? Because I feel like she's like the around the way girl, like she's like girl but next she on door. TV. She's on TV though. We on TV. I know, and I'm like the shit. So that wasn't a good prepare, a good comparison. <laughs> you feel me? Okay, like, okay, hold on, on, hold on. TV. <laughs> You feel me? So, like, niggas at home who have nothing, you got to just picture it, dog. Me and you are on TV, too, so it's different. Imagine, I'm just this regular-ass nigga. The flyest fit I got is some Adidas shell toes, nigga. Damn. I play PS5 at my mama house, nigga, and I watch Gina every Monday. I'm not about to try to DM her, because I know this This not nigga. She on TV. But there's, like, you know, You know like, how that shit be? You feel me? Like, you, you know how, like... But like, certain bitches with, like, that, 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 that bitch with the crazy titties and the hella fake ass, you'd be like, damn, if I DM her, she might not reply. See, see me, like, I, me, I, don't I prefer... I don't give but I I'm prefer... Just saying, like, you know? I prefer a sloppy brunette with a fat ass and big titties. You sloppy? feel me? Like, That's crazy. When I say sloppy, I, I mean, yeah, it's probably not the best yeah, word. Sloppy's yeah, sloppy's crazy. Like, I mean, like... <laughs> <laughs> sloppy is crazy. Sli like a, I prefer a sloppy brunette with hella ass. Like slightly, like that was crazy like, in my head. They don't have to be. I, I prefer like you don't gotta wear hella makeup. You yeah. ain't gotta dress cool. up hella much. Like That's cool. you cute naturally, and you got big titties or some big or a big butt, or you don't even have to. You I'm got not a cute a titty face. Man. You got a cute face. I'm not a titty man. Whatever work, you feel me? Like You're a titty man. I enjoy them. I'm not a titty man. I you can have them. like a, a no cup. I wouldn't give a fuck. Uh, he, but if you he, got hella ass, I'm with that. Look, okay. At the end of the day, the most important thing is a pretty face. It's very underrated. That's facts. facts. Number one. I could take a skinny bitch with just a, a fire ass face any day mm -hmm. over a bitch with ass who's not that cute or like kind of cute and, and not a little bit ass. Like if she's skinny and she fire, I'll take that any day over just So you like, ain't going to take a booger wolf for booty? No. No, but okay. So no. he, here's, here's how You will take a booger wolf for brunette no, hair with booty. Listen, it ain't got to be would. brunette. I like all... No, you no, said no. sloppy. Listen, Bo listen. Wolf. No, no, y'all... y'all oh, booger wolf. <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen. One... So there's, there's face, there's titties and ass, right? Mm -hmm. One out of three, I'm spiking. Order of importance. They're equal. Face is the most important, but they all equal. For spiking, like damn near ass is the most important. But I, for getting dome, I, I like titties better because I'm looking at them. You feel mm -hmm. me? Like if you got big titties, I want you to give me dome. Like all my head doctors b had big titties. Ninety percent. Really a titty man? I don't know. It doesn't do it for me. I grew up in the '90s. You feel mm -hmm. me? Fake titties was the thing before fake booties. Right, like right, it's right, just my right, era. Right. Fake booties is kind of whatever because I didn't hear. I grew couple, up in LA in the '90s. I didn't hit a couple of BBLs and they be overrated. They I look better feel. than they feel. I love BBLs. Some of them, they be they feel cool if they're expensive, but natural is always not better. the hard ones. Like yeah, a yeah. bitch or now say some bitches putting concrete in their ass. Facts. Say a BBL ass is the same size as a natural one though, right? But they like the same size, like a fat ass natural ass mm -hmm. and a fat ass BBL. The natural ass is gonna always be better. Mm -hmm. That shit move better. It feel better. Everything. You feel me? BBL booties is cool, I guess. If it move better, it's better. BBL move as a unit. BBL is supposed to yeah. be fat, though. They, it move, BBL booties move as one. Yeah. Natural uh, asses move with every leg. They got their own mind, mind of their own. Move, boot, they move it's a seesaw. The, yes. Uh, BBL, BBL booty moves It's like together. a seesaw. There's like two seesaws on top of each other. Yeah, but BBL booty moves as like one muscle. It's true. But what I was going to say is this. One out of four, I'm spiking. Two out of three, you, you girlfriend, wifey. I feel that. You got two out of oh, three. Oh, you that easy. No, if you got two out of three. <laughs> oh, if the bitch cute and ass? Oh, yeah, you're, you're coming with me. <laughs> that's that's a strong selling point, sir. That's a strong fucking selling point. I'm, I don't give a fuck if this bitch is a thief. She cute. No, 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 no,
That's the most I, I'm saying. Facts. Cute and ass is definitely like rare, to be honest. I'm not gonna. You're not gonna be my girlfriend if you don't either have a pretty face and booty or crazy booty and titties or a pretty face and titties. Like I'll, I need. I'll two, take pretty two face out of three. and skinny for sure. Yeah, I need yeah, pretty sure, face sure. though. If you have I'll a really, take I, face I know, and skinny. I, I know girls where their face is just so beautiful and they don't really have right. too much body, but their face, lie. like... Dim the bitches with the throats, that's like tunnels. The throat goats. Yeah. But but I've never met a bitch with big titties that don't suck good dick. In fact, I've never met a fat bitch that don't suck good dick. I've never fucked a fat bitch. you never fucked a... You have not lived, my <laughs> I've friend. I've never fucked What's a fat the biggest weight? Uh, nothing to even make me think like, damn, this is a big I thought bitch. you've experienced life, bro. I've never, I'm not, I'm thought, not sticking my dick in, no, in, in like, and I can't see the cracks and crevices. I'm good. I'm good. Nah. Bitch weigh more than 200, I'm out of there. I mean, that's pretty big. Bitch weigh more than 200, I'm, I'm straight. If you weigh 200. Have you got, okay, have you got head from a fat bitch? No. You have never got, I've never no, you've never got, with a fat bitch. not fat and cute? My dick, look, bro. That's, that's like bro, her not squirting. Bro, I've been air you've quote, never, you've never I've been nutted. air quote famous since I was like 16, and I've been light skinned my whole life. I've never, ever, ever struggled to get a bitch in my life. You know, it's so got nothing to do with. Never would I be settling for fat bitches. It's got nothing to do with yes, that. Yes, that's a Sometimes, settle. No. Niggas like you no, 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 will no. be getting done from no, fat no, bitches. No, no, no. I would never in my no, life no, no, no. let no big ass bitch I, I, I will <laughs> ever prefer, in my I'll, life I prefer a fat bitch I'm to good. give me head sometimes no. than a pretty bitch I'm good Especially, what about a pretty fat bitch there's a lot of pretty fat I'm bitches I'm good though oh god I just tell a bitch like damn if you lost 50 pounds you'll be it I just can't do it you will say that to somebody hell yeah Hell yeah, especially if she own me. Like, damn, you so sexy. I'd be like, I ain't gonna lie. If you lost 50 pounds, get at me. But like, no, nah, I'm straight. And it's nothing against them. Like, if live I, your life. If I didn't if you know you. Fat, that's cool, but that just don't years. get my dick hard. If I didn't know you and I hadn't been around you, I would say you're bullshitting. I know you're not. You but feel you me? Know me? I know you're telling oh, the nah, truth. I just but, I, but, but I but honestly, you're depriving yourself. You I'm have, trying to think she's of never the squirted biggest, and you've never busted a nut. Because you've never had your dick sucked by a fat bitch. Nah. And you know what's fire, though? Pregnant pussy. Fire. That's like yo your pregnant? Baby. Fire. That's not your baby. Fire. Pregnant pussy, that's not your baby. Top Are you tier. nutting in it? <laughs> think I'm not. <laughs> pregnant pussy, that's not yours. So you're giving facials hey, to a mama. fetus. That's on my mama. I ain't going to say no names, but right, a nigga paid me for a feature, right? And I fell asleep in the video. And a couple years later, I hit that nigga baby mama with the baby in there. So you 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 busted a facial on an unborn. No, yes. You in there beating up the baby? What? And and it wasn't just a couple months. It was like wobble. Like, what? That shit fire. No, Damn, but, but I will say I'm one. very attracted. Get you one. Pregnant women are very sexy to me. Get you one. I ain't going to lie. After I had my baby, I was like, oh, this is different. And they be horny as fuck, That too. shit feel different. They be very, I ain't gonna lie. Pregnant yeah. coochie is Do it feel like you're hitting anything? No, not at all. It feel regular? Yeah. It's just like fire. Like, nigga, it's, wet. it's wetter, it's, it's bigger. I don't know how to explain it. It's just different. Pregnant mm. Coochie is top tier. No, he's not lying. It's top tier. I heard through the grapevine no that, I'm, that I'm pregnant. Huh? I heard through the grapevine that I'm pregnant. Oh, my God. How do we get here? You got to squirt this first. What I heard. It's top tier. I ain't going to lie. You hit a pregnant bitch that <laughs> wasn't your baby mama? Yeah. Top tier. You yeah. niggas are trifling. Top tier. It wasn't my Definitely. fault. She was on me. trifling. What? Hit the nigga baby So are you only fucking for the back? No. So, y'all only hit in front of back or no. y'all on top I'm of that baby? No. Every, y'all laying on another nigga child? I'm hitting no. any direction. You don't need to, you don't you don't need have to, to lay on the You them. don't got to lay, but yeah. I'm definitely hitting any direction. Legs up, side, Sideways. Back, you crazy as fuck. What I'm girl. in that motherfucker. Hand on the belly. Fuck you mean. <gasps> in that motherfucker. You holding the kid? That ain't my baby. Lay <laughs> hand on the baby. Damn homies. And, I, and I made a song about it. It's, just, an, it's just another curve. What? Pay for my presence. We doing it. Man. So you technically kind of have fucked a fat bitch. Nah, like, she wasn't fat. But, she but, was really small. But, but she be... She was really small. Wait, so you like, got... Like, imagine Gina's side, but then she get pregnant. You know when they skinny, but then yeah, it's yeah, yeah, just yeah. the belly? Yeah. One of those. She was really yeah. little. Wait, She so wasn't, like, fat skinny. You guys' moral compass doesn't say, hey, this isn't a good idea. For what? She's pregnant. What that got to do with me? Oh! When I was, like, a lot of... What a that got to do with me? A lot of my shit, I was, like, fucked up. So that lowers I was my, my moral compass was a little bit skewed. Y'all not scared that another baby gonna grow in there? It's possible. Impo I, that's possible. No, it's not. That's impossible. You know? It's impossible. Yes. Yes. It's impossible. Yes. No, because yes. I've seen a pregnancy where it was You're, twins. You start. 
it that was, was twins. Different, though. I was talking about she was, that's in, in like the gestation period yeah, exactly. in the beginning. You stop that's ovulating. Different. You stop yeah, ovulating. No okay. baby is going to grow after an eight month when it's already in there. That's not and where does, What month is this girl in? She was definitely like to where at the point where nigga. You were about to induce her labor. Her ankle swollen, so at least six months. What's, what's your reaction if she goes into labor mid-stroke? <sighs> He's going to induce labor. It's happened. I ain't going to lie. With my baby mama, I, I induced labor. Like, I, I fucked, and then within three hours, my daughter came. <gasps> Fact. And you were super, you were young. I was, I was like yeah. 16. Yeah. I was like Damn. 16, 15. Did yeah, you panic? I was a kid. And kind of not yeah no I, but it wasn't like right then and there it was like after we fuck and then she hit me like like an hour later she wake me up kind of like my stomach hurt and a couple hours later they they wake me up like she in the hospital i'm like damn that was me did she yeah, squeeze your yeah. hand i cut the umbilical cord and all that i put the baby out cut the umbilical cord i did the whole thing i was there. 16 years old yep 16 <gasps> grown-ass man facts so mature yeah, I, I cut the umbilical cord. I pressed one of the nurses for, um, you know, when they pull the baby out and they got to, like, prick her, pr prick the foot or whatever for the blood. I pressed the nurse. I almost pushed the bitch. I was on it. Like, this is my kid. I yeah, was I'm on not, it, on it. I'm but, yeah, pregnant pussy that's not yours is top tier. Ask around. Facts. Because when it's your baby, you got to be gentle and shit. Like, but, but, it's your you baby, don't care about the but, baby. But, but the thing, my kid. Yeah, but, 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 also, crazy. But, but also, a lot of times, the the man's not sticking around. So you fucking a, a unclaimed bitch. Y'all don't look pregnant. at the girl as being trifling? Yes. Of course. Most definitely. But that that's trifling why, pussy that, hit? That's why, yeah, when, trifling that's, why, pussy that's, why that's why when you hit it, you be like, yeah you, yeah, you like that, you little slut. <laughs> 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 I ain't going to lie. I wanted to do it because the whole time, right? The nigga Are you niggas talking to the baby? Look, the nigga paid me for a feature mm -hmm. back in the day. I fell asleep in the video, and then he was talking about on, on the internet. You know a video I'm talking yeah. about, too. I fell asleep in the video, and then the nigga was all on the internet like, yeah, bitch-ass nigga, we could have robbed you all up in your sleep. Bitch-ass nigga came to the video sleep, but they, I fell asleep because they took like an hour for the cameraman to get there. I'm on time. They say, pull up at 6. I'm on time. And you leaned out. The camera, I'm linked out. The cameraman doesn't get there until 8 o'clock. So, yeah, I'm asleep for most of the scene. You said be here at 6. Right. I'm here at 6. So, 8 o'clock come. Long story short, he talking shit on the internet. Bitch ass nigga, we could have robbed you. Woop, 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 woop. Two years later, LA nigga? he get, the, yes, he get this bitch pregnant. What? She, I hit her. Six months. <laughs> Big, I'm like, oh, did you, yeah, did you hit her because of, mama. you hit Fuck. her because of who baby mama was, or you was really, and she was fire, <laughs> and she okay, was fire. wait, she was we, we have an update, oh, and it's eight o'clock, we have an update though, hold on, about what, Flacco is saying he found the yearbook, and he sent a video, 2016, I thought he graduated in 2015. Yeah, he's that's what he said before, but now the narrative is no, changing. No, he has a 2016 yearbook when he graduated in 2015. I do see him, but I don't see the cover of the yearbook. And it's a lot of black kids. This does not look like... There's no way in hell this is North Dakota, bro. There's no way here. It don't matter. He lost already. But he did find a yearbook. Bro, they say 2016. I'm confused as fuck. They already said oh, he went that... back by then anyway, so that wouldn't help his case. But he, and he but said... But he said he finished school in 2015. 15. This is... Bro, this is like three realities of the Mandela effect yeah. bisecting. There's like, no way that there should be Flacco present in a 2016 yearbook if he graduated in 2015. Now the 2016. But it did. Why didn't he show us the cover of the book? Why? Yeah. Like, why wouldn't he? Like, and does that look like you see all the kids in there? That looks like North Dakota to you? No. Too many black kids. I, Come on. I the 2016 one. school year does begin in 2015. I see but that one would mean that you kid. didn't graduate no, that, in 2015. If you're class of 2015, you're. Yeah. That would have been 2014, 2015. Yeah. Not 2015, yeah. 2016. Mm. So it's again, it's not making sense. So if he graduated in 2016, then that's another year at it. Bro, there's not that many black people in North Dakota. I'm sorry. Well, uh, that's been a Monday show. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in. Make sure y'all like, share, subscribe, and uh, we'll catch y'all next week. Gone.